Don't, don't receive in our newspaper. This isn't the water that's been sitting down here for two months, right? No, why? Okay, all right. <laughs> but wait, you, is two-month-old water not good enough for you anymore? Uh, no, it's good. It's good. You were drinking from puddles at work, and now well, all of a sudden... I'm in that. public now. <laughs> Boys, we look sick as fuck. I know, I'm, I'm so it. glad we got glass. Love the idea. Quick, quick yeah. little buy. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> quick. I, mean, I just bought these. Shout out to the gas station. What gas station? Uh, buy your hose, yeah. On the run, on the pioneer. Run. Yeah. Shout oh out, my shout god, out to buy twenty dollars off the shelf. So oh, I don't know. I what? guess these are high end glasses. When's, when's the last time you guys had a slush puppy? Oh fuck! Yeah, they it's they been got them. Yeah, they got them. Oh colors. ten. Oh All ten. Colors. Oh wow. Oh ten. Oh ten. Oh ten. Oh ten. Really? Oh ten, bro. Oh, you already know twenty four. You're saying it's been fucking fourteen <laughs> years. Fourteen years at least. When's the last time you had a slush puppy? You know what those are? Oh ten, so from good. From She's a young man. Yeah, yeah. I can go for one right now. A slush pop. Have to so way back. Good. God, dude, the one where you get to like you add the syrup yourself. You ever had that? Oh, oh shit. The extra that's syrup. OG. Yeah, that's OG. Or the yeah. shockers. For yeah. The yes. Yep. I remember that. I remember the shock. I stole brown? half a bottle of that shit and poured it in. What flavor you like? Blue. Yep. I yeah, was blue. Blue. blue is the only proper Blue's flavor. Whoa. Only proper. Whoa. Blue, blue Whoa. and green are my green, favorite. Green, green. Yeah. I've never had a green. Well, this green, okay. Either, I, 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 I like all three. You're but if, guy, if you got a choice, I'm always picking blue. Like for almost any like Jolly Ranchers, thing. blue, blue, blue. Yeah, yeah, yeah same. Yeah, nah. think of it. You can't. Nah, Jolly Ranchers for me are like red. R- the red really? one? cherry. Yeah, yeah. I mix red and cherry together. The green one, the green one of the Jolly Ranchers is good, man. It's pretty good. Apple, right? Green apple. Yeah, yeah. Green apple, but blues where it's at. Bro. Blues. Where I'll go at, to bro. Bulk Barn and deliberately pick every blue one out. Swear <laughs> my life. I swear <laughs> to God, I'll do that. <laughs> I, will, I will. I'll stand there. I'll have her Dude, hold the bag, and I'm like, hold saying on. Saying I will. We did this like two weeks ago. We literally do this. All I did the time. this. I do really? this. Oh yeah, bro. I want the blue ones. You're a piece yeah. of shit. I want the fucking. <laughs> You're a piece of I shit. I want yeah. the. What about the other people that want the blue ones? Fuck them. I haven't <laughs> had a Jolly Rancher. I don't even. Oh, I it's know. been a while. Oh ten. Oh eleven. Why are we? A while. Yeah, it's been a minute. Because yeah. I used to have them like you know uh, like on plane rides like not pop your ears like usually suck that them. My mommy doesn't tell me to do that. Yeah. yeah. I'm about to go on a plane for the first time. So yeah. Oh, yeah. Get the window, Hope it doesn't bro. crash. That'd be crazy, right? The window's the best. You're going to be thinking crazy. about that the well, whole time, probably. I'll just be probably. thinking when I have that blue Jolly Rancher on the way down. I'll fuck it. <laughs> 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 My ears aren't going to pop, at least. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> this yeah, plane will, well. but yeah. <laughs> this plane fucking pop. I, there's too many. You know what? That's what I don't like. I'm about to go on a plane. And there's too many fucking videos. Like, do you guys see recently where, that, where just some dude in the middle of their plane ride was like, I don't want to be here anymore. And then try to open the fucking door. Yeah. What the Crazy. fuck? Or people like freaking out. Yeah. Yeah. He was freaking out. Or like when the one panel came off. You remember that? Yeah. Of American Airlines. Like they had, they just, the one plane with the fame just fucking off. Ah, people are sitting there. Fast your seatbelt sign. And I guess the, the, <laughs> the two people that were supposed to sit there too missed their flight. Wow. Miss their flight. Final destination. No. <laughs> that movie terrified me. Bro. Yeah, it is a Did terrifying it? movie. Oh, the roller coaster and shit. Is yeah. that the picture of it, Rain? Holy fuck. Wow. Imagine you sit next to that thing. Whoosh, whoosh, just, <laughs> yeah, you're so You hit the out. stewardess button. You hit the flight attendant button. I don't want to sit here anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Can I move seats? Do I get like a discount? Yeah. Can I get in the cockpit? Look at that hole. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. You ever seen that photo of the pilot who got sucked out of the window? Nope. Yes. You, we, talked you we talked we, about oh, it. We talked about it. I'm sure. Show him the crazy. picture. Show him that picture. That picture is insane. This dude got sucked out of the fucking front. The po- co- like the pilot, co-pilot got sucked out of the fucking the front window. The front window. The, <laughs> the other, the other, fucking like legs. fucking flight attendants, the pilot are holding his legs. Is this one it? The there fuck? it is, right there. What? Yeah. Yeah, bro. British Airlines never find that. Is he all right? Oh yeah, he lived. He lived, but he he was, lived, but it was like, that can't you know, be good for you. <laughs> Just pull up the image. Yeah. Pull up the image. Yeah. You see this dude just getting fucking just. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> He's suntanning. <laughs> <laughs> oh, getting some sun you're, like, you're, you're not conscious. <laughs> no. No. Nah, the minute you no. get sucked out of that window, you pass out. Oh, Easily, the, wind, yeah. the wind burn. Yeah, but I was expecting wow. it to be way worse. The wind, oh, that looks bad. <laughs> like that, that looks, looks pretty like, bad. That looks fresh. That's not two days after wind burn. You know what I mean? That's <laughs> yeah. not two days where your skin's peeling. His bandages shit. are off there. Probably. Like, look yeah. at this motherfucker. Imagine being the fucking pilot that's the whole lot. Oh, God. <laughs> like, <laughs> How'd that even happen, though? The uh, the window popped out. 
Just out of nowhere? Air pressure probably just fucked it up. Probably popped yeah. out. Yeah. Bro, when you're up in the sky, like, when there's so many. in that sky. <laughs> like, there's so many videos of people, like, showing the wing of the plane, and it's, like, a bolt's loose. So it's just rattling. I've just rattling videos, on yeah. the fucking. Or, like, there was a there's, dude. There's the inside. Yeah. Oh, my. Quick selfie real quick. Yeah, you man, you won't believe the day I had at work. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Take a picture for my insurance, please. <laughs> my wife won't believe me. My <laughs> wife won't believe this. <laughs> but like there's that there's even like there was another video where Dude sitting and like one of the plane engines, the guy's t- duct taping it. Imagine seeing a guy <laughs> yeah. duct taping your fucking end. I'm getting off the plane. I yeah, wouldn't want it any other way. Most reliable <laughs> source we got. Duct tape. Well, duct tape. Duct if tape he maybe did like two or three like strips, it was a single. <laughs> just <laughs> just, one. just one. on the end. Well, I don't want to waste all this duct tape. It costs Can't money. Use a whole <laughs> roll on one plane. There's other planes here. <laughs> Being a plane fuck. mechanic must be wild. That's what my mom's boyfriend does. Plane mechanic. That's right. He yeah. does do that. In the but, states. So but is it like cash. the big planes? Money, yeah. Like yeah, those, the big planes. You had those big ones. Nice. There's a bunch of different planes. Too many. Just planes. There's Drake got his own fucking plane? plane. Have I been on a plane? Huge yeah. plane. Yeah. yeah. Huge. You, you like think it? that thing's all decked out too? Dude, Easy. I wanted to be a pilot for a bit. Yeah. 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 What happened? A lot of stuff. A lot of few things. Yeah. Few things happened. Yeah. Yeah. Not a pilot. I'm not a pilot now. And I that, work construction. I live in the dirt now. But I work <laughs> directly under where all the planes come in for the airport, so it's a constant reminder of my failures. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, it sucks. Keep yourself humble. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. When I'm down in the in a dirt pit, just, yeah. just covered in mud, I'm like, yeah. this could, is how close. Could have been me up there. This is how close. <laughs> could have been there. Could have been you. Could have been me. I mean, I still could. Yeah. So I have to pay for it myself now. You're just traveling all the time, right? Just yeah. as a pilot, you're just—it's probably one of the craziest ways, though, to see like the, the world. world. Yeah. You yeah. know what I mean? Like, yeah. you're just like, I'm going to fucking—I don't know—I'm flying to Dubai. I'm just gonna go see Dubai for a little bit, or I'm flying to fucking Brazil. Depending on what yeah. license you get, dude, you can just kind of rent a plane and take off. Yeah, and well, then if you work there too, bro, like, not even you were telling me, right, Rain? Like, if some, like, if even you're just like the person that loads like bags and stuff, you get like free flights and shit. Oh, yeah, probably, my yeah. Does that. My yeah. uncle works at the the airport, and he, I think he just does that. Like he just loads up people's shit onto the thing that goes round around, mm. and like him and all of his immediate family get free flights. Nice. Like they get put nice. on to like a list, um, and then they're like priority if like somebody doesn't show up, and they immediately get to go on, including oh. like first class. Everything doesn't matter. Mm. That's crazy. That's yeah. Crazy. I would love to fucking just have free flights, but like you know what you cost, you pay more for is like uh. I mean, I don't even know as a guy that flies, but I'm just hearing this like baggage. Mm. Like, if you got to bring your plane or you got to check your luggage, I hear you're paying. That's more why for I shove all my stuff into the carry on. <laughs> <laughs> Gone for a week. Yeah. Backpack, just shove it in there. Yeah. That's all you need. My dad told me he's gonna pack his carry on with snacks. <laughs> That's it. For a two hour flight. For a two hour flight. He was Good like, for him. and I said the flight, and I told him that I was like, the flight's two hours. He's like, so is a movie. I'm gonna, I'm gonna <laughs> snack. For two hours. Hell of a good dip. <laughs> Hell, Hell of a good dip. dip. Yeah. Hell of a good dip on ice. You know, you know my dad, too. My dad would bring his own bag of Lay's. <laughs> Hell of a good dip and just... Oh. You don't give a fuck. I'd be with him, bro. I'd be killing you with him. You gotta enjoy the flight. That's just How are you gonna so enjoy good, the man. flight? If you two can't hours. Have, can't have Lay's and Hell of a good dip. All of a sudden, what? Fucking <laughs> put a movie on. Muck that. Good flight. It's good flight. You yeah. disturb yeah. everyone around. Have you been on a plane? Yeah, a few times. A few times? Yeah, just to Florida. Just to Florida. Yeah. Yeah. But I swear, like... My tailbone has never been the same because I From swear Florida? I sat down in the same spot. I just I swear like I have to move around now when I sit. And it's weird. Yeah. From the plane? Is that what you're saying? Uh, yeah, I swear. Oh. I, th- I mean, I think I did dislocate it though because like I went to go sit and like <laughs> oh, our buddy pulled the chair and I landed <laughs> straight on hardwood. Oh no, dude, wasn't, you mean the same? Yeah, <laughs> this guy's gonna have to go to the shop. We're gonna yeah, literally. I wish there was change this in the hospital like a genuine. Scanner that does everything. You didn't ask the Just doc. tell me what's wrong. You everything. Ask, you didn't ask the doc when he was in there. Hey, maybe you can tune some things up. Let's tune it up. My shoulder fucked. <laughs> my <laughs> shoulder fucked. Uh, yeah, why you're in there? That's my least concern. Take a look. Fix it Just, up. Why I'm under? Just take a look. Yeah. Just take a look. You don't even have to work on it. Just yeah. tell me what's wrong. Do you know what I mean? It's like a consultation. Yeah. <laughs> didn't want to be there any longer than I needed to be. Yeah. What? Yeah. What was finally the thing for you? Because you you had that problem for a long time. Uh, I finally just got in. You were just like, well, so they wanted to take five steps. They were like, we don't want to take your gallbladder out right away because it could be something else causing issues as well. So they thought my heart and my large intestine were on the right side of my body, not my left. Mm -hmm. 
So what do they call that? Which is wild. Yeah, There's something uh, for that, crazy. right? Uh, I'm it's sure insanely rare. Yeah. Insanely rare. But I could have told them. I could have told you. I I'm feel pretty it. sure I hear my heart. And like here. maybe TMI. <laughs> I know we're maybe TMI. Heart. But when I have to do my functions, I definitely feel relief on my left side. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. But then I had a CAT scan and it showed I was normal, kind of. And they're like, "Yeah, you're facing with surgery now, or unless you want to have this supplement, you take it the rest of your life, four thousand dollars a month." Okay, well, so I was like, "Okay, surgery, surgery, it is. Yeah. I don't surgery, well, it I mean, is. How, how much? How many times you got to take it a month? You know, <laughs> every day, for a month, every day, four thousand dollars, four thousand dollars a month. But was it Cut because it, it was the pain? It was like, was the pain just so much to the point where you were like, "Fuck this." Yeah, because I couldn't, like, I couldn't get comfortable. Like, uh, I don't know, just random times I get, like, like you know, like when I was out with him, like, yeah. I just feel the pain, like, the right side of my stomach it would go to my left side. Mm -hmm. And so apparently that causes issues in, like, my shoulder and, like, everything else. Because once one thing's fucked, everything's yeah. fucked. Mm -hmm. It is weird how your body is so, like... And long-term. Bec because, like, trainers or, like, massage therapists and chiropractors would be, like... If you got like pain in your back, they're like working on your legs. Yeah, it all connects. Like, you know what I mean? It yeah. all is like it's so fucking. Weird. I didn't realize until I had gallstone. Yeah, I yeah. was like, fuck. Well, like, after that happened, my ankle doesn't hurt anymore. My shoulders <laughs> doesn't hurt anymore. Like it's actually weird. Like I feel, really, I feel it doesn't great. hurt anymore. I feel good, dude. Yeah. dude. That used to be his biggest problem. Yeah, was like good. my this shoulder. I, like, I can't wait. It's just to a work quick out. oil change. I can't. Got to work out. <laughs> 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 gotta get that filter out. Yeah. Hey, you gotta get that out every once in a while. It's good as new now. Yeah, it's fresh. Watch out. Just watch out. Just wait. Just wait. Watch. Zachary just went to the fucking. I got that shirt ripped out. Now the fucking gym's my bitch. <laughs> hide your moms, hide your daughters. Yeah. Watch out. Yeah, yeah. Shoul <laughs> shoulders not impeding. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna be fresh now. I'm gonna be fresh. I'm ready to fucking rock. Mm. That's good, Zach. I'm, I'm glad that you finally got that done, man. Yeah, appreciate bro. it, bro. Because like, you know, I don't want to see you hurt, bud. You're Talk one of my years. boys. Mm. You're one of my boys. I don't want to see you hurt, yeah. injured. Can't have Zach two, Reed injured out here. Two no. years. It's not a good time. Two years. Yeah, dude. To be honest, it when you sent me more. that picture of you in the hospital, I'm like, this could be a thousand things. <laughs> this, could <laughs> be, <laughs> this could mean a lot. This, yeah. this could mean. This could be a couple different issues. Right? <laughs> yeah, you sent me a snap back. You're like, you're right. You're good? You good? <laughs> yeah, you're good? Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, that was the worst, bro. Because, like. I had a catheter in my dick for like 16 oh. hours. Were you awake when they had to put it in? Uh, they had to put it in. I was awake. Because I had, so I had fluid in my lungs. I had fluid in my lungs. And so when they drained it, it went to my bladder. I had six liters in my bladder. Wow. Whoa. Yeah, and I couldn't pee. Wait, when you had fluid in your lungs, they didn't put a catheter in your lungs? No. What the fuck? They did that to me. I didn't even know that was a thing. They put the catheter through I, the back, through the back of my ribs. Yeah, they did it with my grandma too. And they my lung like that. Yep. And then they sent me home with fluid in it still. What? Well, I was like, huh? I well, if they drain your lungs get back without being <laughs> intrusive, and it went to your bladder, they wouldn't have had to put a catheter in your lungs. Why it depends. It depends how, like, because I'm, I'm assuming yours was probably a little more severe. Yeah. Yeah, you had a different <laughs> issue than me. <laughs> yeah. yeah still had the same issues. Same issues. Same issues. Hey, everyone's got a little fluid in your lungs. You know, mine's mostly blood. <laughs> hey, I was... Mine was too. Yeah, Doctor asked like, if he hey, could do it. I said keep it. Yeah. I said keep it there. I don't want oh, it so, gone. So Keeps me buoyant. Yours, when yours got flushed out, you didn't get to see the cool gunk that came out? No. Dude, oh. I had a little friend. I named him Jerry. It was a blood clot. It was I do remember that for some reason. Yeah. It was fucking awesome. It was like this no. big. It was sick. What? The stuff... Oh. What? The stuff that... Yeah. Like, I remember my dad going to the hospital, and he had to get a fucking tube through his nose into his stomach. Yeah. Because his his intestines were inflamed, yeah. so he couldn't pass anything. Wow. So they had to suck everything up. Yeah, from that the, was the day you guys came and visited me, that was the day I got that tube out. <sighs> Fuck. That is a rough... Good thing we didn't show up the day before. Holy fuck. <laughs> 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 I mean, we were going to, and Lex is like, not today, not today, not today. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah we were going, yeah. yeah. But yeah, no, that shit sucks. Like, it does. Ugh. It was fucked. Having, because like, they stuffed the two down my throat. Yeah. Because I couldn't breathe, because I had fluid in my lungs when they put me out. And then I just fucking woke up from my surgery, and just so much blood was coming out of my mouth, just spitting it up. I had like you know at the dentist they have that thing that sucks up all your spit. Yeah. I was just like, hey, give me it, give me it, give me the thing, because I, I can't spit. I'm looking to spit everywhere. I'm just like, holy fuck, I can't. I'm in a it. hospital. I'm spitting on the floor. So it's just all <laughs> sucking it up, sucking. <laughs> Real awful. Yeah. No, for real. At that point, no yeah. one's there. To, I was I, in the hospital for like I know obviously rain beats me, but I was in like 50 hours this weekend, that weekend, because then I had to go back 10 and a half hours. 
in the ER just for them to take an x-ray of my chest to look for blood clots. They're like, ah, yeah, you're probably just coughing up blood from the tube. So yeah. I'm like, okay, weird. Go back the next day for another seven and a half hours. And then they got a CAT scan. They're like, oh, no, yeah, you have pneumonia. So I'm like, okay, I'm glad you guys sent me home and just didn't give me a CAT scan then. Like, I don't know why it just didn't happen or keep me overnight again. There's so many cases they of that. Mm-hmm. I had pneumonia two years ago. They yeah. don't. They just get, so pneumonia is supposed to be like one of those things because it's super fucking serious. They're supposed to medicate you and keep you in hospital. Is it that serious? They Yeah. Oh, you can shit. die from pneumonia. <laughs> Fuck. Um, they gave me un antibiotic and sent me home. And then I went to a different hospital and they were like, the fuck they sent you home? <laughs> and then they kept me. You doctors are always surprised of what other doctors are doing. Yeah. You ever notice that? Yeah. They're like, what did that doctor tell you? What did that doctor prescribe you? <laughs> three different like, doctors what? told me three different things. Yeah. yeah but that's... Yeah. that's who I always get. trust the first guy. I'm rolling with that. <laughs> 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 if it gets worse after, I'm like... Psh. <laughs> Go with that one. The doctor said I'd be fine. <laughs> There's so many cases of that though, where people are like, "Oh, I went to this doctor and he couldn't help me," and then they're like, "Really? This doctor in like London can help you?" <laughs> and then they'll just go to fucking London. Yeah, mm-hmm. that yeah. happened with like my grandfather when he was alive. Like he had something wrong with his. I forget exactly what it was. I was young. I was too young to remember. But I remember like the doctor was just like, "You're gonna be stuck on this fucking medication for the rest of your life," and then they didn't like that answer, and uh, yeah. so they were like, "Hold on," and then the. Another doctor in like London ended up helping him out. That's good. Whatever. Yeah. But you usually got to wait for those doctors. Specialists. Mm-hmm. Specialists. Specialists. Yeah. yeah. Got to wait for those motherfuckers. Yeah. Got to fucking pencil you in. What's well, I mean now? I got to go to see a respirologist. And... Oh, fuck yeah. They're making you a client. And, well, <laughs> well, I got my organs are all inflamed too, though. Yeah. Well, from my gallbladder. Yeah. So. But there's a lot. Well, hey. There's, you just gotta tell them one thing at a time. Here, yeah, we're know? vibing. Right? Yeah, yeah. We're, yeah. We're, we're in a good time. You just gotta get the vehicle back on the road. You can yeah. adjust everything after on weekends. Yeah. That's yeah. how I look yeah. at it. <laughs> That's how I look at it. Yeah. You keep it enough to get you to there and there, there and back there again. There yeah. and back. That's all you need. Right? Until it becomes a problem. Just drink, <laughs> drink water and yes, you'll be fine. Do it, yeah. doing, yeah. Listen, trust my medical advice. If there's anything I know about medicine, <sighs> um, trust me, I want that type of medicine. <laughs> but <laughs> listen, get. I'm not a doctor. Get a cold <laughs> beer. Get, get, get some vitamins. Sit down. Watch Interstellar. I'm telling you, you'll feel better, better by the fucking... Great movie. Great Holy movie. Holy shit, Thank it's you. a good movie. Man. I, even, I said th- the day that movie came out, it should be a national holiday. And I remember we it's that one movie. episode we did where movie. I was like, th- this should it. be a holiday. This should be a holiday. We were trying to come up with yes. different holidays. You remember that episode? Interstellar Day. Interstellar Day. I and, I th- and I said... Even if you're not going to let the kids have it off, you got to let them watch at school. Yeah. You have to. <laughs> like children. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Be, yeah. Like, okay, kid. Like, grade five. Every year, yeah. you're they looking kid. forward to Interstellar Day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I would. I'm look, I look forward to Interstellar Day. I would. Yeah. <laughs> it's a, it's a th- thing in my day. I watch it once a year. He's never, watched watched it. It. He's never watched it. Here, I tried. I'm telling you, please you watch it. Zach. It's a long movie, but it's good. It's worth it. It's so worth it. Yeah. I don't even notice it's long when I'm watching it, dude. No, yeah, you I've don't. S- I've seen a clip where thriller. like Matthew McConaughey was just like slamming, yeah. saying no. Yeah, that's like yeah. Yeah. that's like literally one of the craziest scenes. Yeah, it's, it's a crazy <laughs> yeah. scene, bro. It's not even the coolest scene. Now. It's not the coolest crazy, scene. The yeah. docking scene's the coolest yeah. scene. That's, yeah, yeah, that's, that's holy shit. Yeah. Tsunami. Is that, is that 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 happens too? Yeah. That's not even the coolest scene. Yeah. All right, don't don't even tell me. I don't. I want to <laughs> talk about it bad now. Yeah, it is that good? It's like, that good. Oh, Killer yeah. cast. Yeah. Killer yep. cast. Yep. You, the whole story was good. I'm pissed about the rating it got. Remember, we looked at the yeah. rating. We were like, that's fucking bullshit. Seventy three percent on Rotten Tomatoes. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> Fuck Rotten Tomatoes. You can't critic shit. You yeah. know what I mean? Who the fuck are you? Let us. <laughs> we're talking about Let us fucking rate movies. Have like the Rotten Tomatoes four clip certified <laughs> critic. Okay. And then audience. Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? The general audience, what they're rating it. That movie is fucking phenomenal. It's it so very good. good. It really is. It re- like, they did such a good job, and there's nothing like that now. I no. try to watch so much shit now. We nope. talk about that constantly. It's all garbage. I even I'm rewatching documentaries now. Like I rewatched that Last Dance documentary. God, it's so good. So good, right? So good. Who's the yeah. goat? Jordan. I think Jordan's the goat. I know you. I know you're a LeBron. LeBron James. I know you're a LeBron. Yeah. <laughs> I just I can't. I'm not a basketball I, guy as it is. I'm yeah. just, I gotta say Jordan. I get Jordan because he, he changed too. the game of basketball. Mm-hmm. I get that. But I think LeBron down the stats, he's number one. Everywhere. That first one that you said. You're welcome. Yeah. The Last Dance. That's the, the documentary that's talking great. about. It's great. Yeah. Do you I can't it? remember basketball player. It's Jordan. You said Jordan? Yeah. I know that one. Yeah. 
and LeBron. Yeah. I, oh, I was gonna say you gotta know fucking. I do LeBron. know. I know the two names. Is this? It's this funny with like. Dennis Rodman, like I watched. The, Follow him is, on Instagram. Yeah, because he was in North Korea. Yes, and it was <laughs> so funny for so long when he had zero clue. Like I watched a North Korean documentary, and they talked about the time that Dennis Rodman <laughs> went, and then he goes, uh, Kim Jong Un goes, you know, I'd love to come see a Chicago uh, Bulls game, and he goes. Yeah, but like, why don't we set that up? Like, you know, <laughs> that, that, I can get that arranged. I can get that no arranged. Idea what's going and on. he had z- like zero. That's why he was like, he was so shocked when everyone gave him hate when he came back. He had like, he's like, yeah. Kim's cool. Kim cool. What are you talking <laughs> no. about? All the people who they just fight. like basketball. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. And then like they're sitting down. And he's like, Yeah, we can re. He goes, I don't think America wants me there. And he goes, What? What do you mean they don't want you there? <laughs> like, you know what I mean? so, I'm Dennis Rodman. I can get you in. I can get you in, man. Yeah. We can have a great time. <laughs> Dennis has had a life, man. Yeah. That I guy has had a life. Yeah. He was so innocent, too. They talked about it before he got in the NBA. And then, like, he, uh, what was it? He was dating Madonna. And then Madonna was like, you just got to be your true self. Yeah. That's, and then, and then that's all flipped. it took for him to be like, you're right. The, na- <laughs> the nails and shit. He got nails, the nails, his the hair. hair. Yeah. When you did that 33 when Scottie Pittman came back, that shit's dope. That Good friends dope. with yeah. Putin. Good? Yeah, good friends with Putin. Is he good friends with I Putin, too? He's good, yeah, I'm he's good sure. friends with he's Putin. He's tight with all. Yeah, like, yeah, he's just yeah, looking yeah. for all the dicks. He's a genuine guy. Crazy <laughs> life. Crazy life. Yeah. Zero. He's like, no, I'm not going to let the media influence me. I'm just going to go talk to the guy myself. I'll find yeah. out for me. I'll go, I'll go talk to the guy myself. I like myself. that, though. That's awesome, yeah. Yeah, he's... <laughs> not a lot of people have the opportunity to do that, going blind. Mm. To meet international dictators. No, and he's just partying there, having a good time, yeah. playing basketball with Kim. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? I would. I'll, he's re- dunking on do you Kim. remember the? You remember the scene where he's like sitting there and he walks in, they're all clapping, he thinks they're clapping for him, they just don't stop. He goes, "Man, they just keep clapping. They I mean, just keep going. They just keep <laughs> clapping, just, man. I'm fucking here to play basketball. <laughs> like, what the fuck is happening? Because I'm just think, yelling and clapping. Because they asked Jordan first, and Jordan was like, "No." <laughs> <laughs> And I was like, absolutely not. I'm not going over there. They went to Dennis, and Dennis was like, I'll fucking go. Who? Sure. (laughs) It's so funny, too, in the middle of, like, their last dance, like, he had to dip, too. He's like, dude, I need, I just need a break. Go away. They were okay with it. Yeah, they They were chill. You're back? Go away. He was gone for, what, 78 hours? Something like that, yeah. Like, during the middle of, like, their NBA, like, trying to get to the NBA finals, he was like, I need to leave. Yeah. (laughs) I need to, like, you know how his job. Went to Vegas or something like that. Yeah, he did. They they were late. Yeah, and he was late, came back. They're making, yeah, they said only, they, what did they tell him? 48 hours. You get 48 hours. Yeah. And he goes, got it. Didn't show up for 82. <laughs> <laughs> and then, you got it. <laughs> and then he goes, and then he goes, uh, yeah, I just needed to leave for a bit. But I guess, supposedly, they're supposed to be making a movie on that, of him leaving okay. to Vegas. Oh, probably so good, too. <laughs> yeah, he was just partying. Uh, just partying, bro. Interstellar day. We're like Dennis Rodman day. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah, brother. Yeah, yeah. That day is falling shortly behind. <laughs> They're going to get Dennis Rodman. Next day. Well, he went on the WWE that weekend, too, right? Yeah, bro, he that? went. Mm-hmm. What Crazy. was it? The AF, AFW or something like that. That's yeah. like with Hulk WWF. Hogan and shit. AFT or something like that? Something like that. Yeah, yeah. And he's like, I'm just going to go party with Hulk Hogan. For like the night. Well, you yeah. gotta chill. You're trying to chill out before the NBA finals, so yeah. you go do Didn't some WWE shit. Didn't he miss a game? Because I'm not sure about that. I thought he missed something no, too. I, th- I think he showed back up like when they had a game. When and they he had, had to it. sneak into the uh, to dodge all the media. Right. Yes, he did. Yeah, yeah he did. Because mm-hmm. he didn't show up to practice. Didn't show yeah. up to nothing else. But at the same time, when you have a guy who hops on the court and gives you 25 rebounds, can't go the wrong. Most there. energy on the court. Yeah. Doesn't yeah, that make sense. Why are you going to tell Dennis to go like sit on bench here? Like yeah. you can't. No. Yeah. Yeah. It's funny that they this were a different player. Because if it was anybody else, uh, reamed they just reamed their anybody else. Yeah, <laughs> like Jordan would got fucked over that. Yeah, you're not showing up the, the slander. Yeah, the slander, the media, all over him. Yeah, all but over. he still would have probably showed up and gave you forty. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. So, especially, yeah. especially for Phil Jackson, for a coach like that to come in. And be like, hey, man, you don't need to do it all yourself. Yeah. <laughs> like, that's what yeah. the, the, you could pep, the pep talk was to him. Was yeah. this like, hey, man, I know like you think you could just win the game on your own. But it's like you have all these people around you. Like they're good, yep. too. They're yep. in the NBA, too. He had the same conversation <laughs> with Kobe Bryant. Far. Yeah. yeah. And him and Shaq were sat down. Kobe were like, you can, you can use your players around you. Yeah. That's when they won the chip. I mean that, yeah, that is true though, right? right? Like you can't win it all on your own. No, it's so can't. crazy to yeah. think. Yeah, you can. <laughs> <laughs> Chase is like, let me get on there right now. Yeah. I'll I'll pull up six back to back to back right now. NBA <laughs> final championships. Yeah. That is wild for. I don't even think another team has done that since, right? The Bulls. 
has another two team three peats. Uh, three peats, yeah, two three peats like that. No, no, only team. Where, where, I think the Celtics were the first, probably. That was about it. Yeah. Where to go? Went three peat. Jordan said, "Ah, I'm gonna go play some baseball for yeah. a year and a half." Comes back three peat. <laughs> some stupid like that. Yeah, that's why I have a hard time with the LeBron goat talk. That's yeah. the only reason. Yeah. Why? Because he left. No, well, like just, just the, the way Jordan did it, the like, dominance. Yeah, had. like but basketball then and now is totally different. You're right. Totally different. I'm not gonna say Michael's not dropping 40 in today's game, but he's not. I don't think he's top 10 player. But I, I wouldn't even say top three. Shut oh, the fuck up. Fuck. Stop. <laughs> oh God. Stop it. I'm like I'm, I don't know. Stop. Say your top right three. Now. Now. Top three all time. Yeah. LeBron, Kareem, Magic. All Lakers players, but whatever. I mean, not, not Kareem. Well, Kareem's Magic, Lakers too, yeah. Magic over Jordan. Yeah. Yeah. Some would argue that, too. I feel like a lot of people would argue See, that. See, I, like, I don't even – I can't argue this. Like, me and him definitely can't because we def- – he don't watch sports. I'm not a basketball, basketball I don't even know who. Yeah. I'm not one a big basketball guys guy. Like that. <laughs> Magic Johnson? I knew that one. Oh, yeah. Because of some other stuff. Yeah. yeah. But the, <laughs> the second guy, I have no idea who that is. Kareem the Dream. Kareem the Dream. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> Was the leading scorer, and then Le- LeBron passed him. So, no, so he's nobody. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I got out of that. Chase is like, I'll join the NBA you right ain't now. ain't first. 40,000 points. <laughs> you ain't first, bud. You last. Well, you last. Yes. What can I say? Talladega Knights, well, another I, great move. Well, yeah. if you do look at the numbers, though, like I even did the numbers, <clears throat> like Jordan has so much less games played. So if he played as much as LeBron, he'd actually have more points than LeBron. Mm. Did you know that? Probably, yeah, because he did play less, less seasons, too. Mm-hmm. I get that. A lot less games and shit. Yeah, Why? Because are you Who got more Jordan? championships? I, I can't. I don't Who know. Who won what to more? Say. It's, hard, it's hard for me to argue. Yeah. Michael has Cause six. You gotta think, LeBron has been playing in the NBA since he was 18 years old. Six or five. And he's. Yeah. He just, he's 20, 22 years. Still as good. If not, he's just better. Phenomenal. He just gets better. No. Yeah. It doesn't make sense. Longevity. Doesn't make sense. Longevity. LeBron's like Brady. Like, yep, longevity exactly. training. I think like, the aging like a fine wine. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. aging like a fine wine, yeah. like a rose, if yes. you would. Yeah. <laughs> but, like, no, bro, I don't know. I think what you were saying, like, longevity, yep. it's like th- it's got to be the fucking personal trainers and the doctors that they have because yeah. it's like you got to steroids. Think- Yes. Nutrition. You th- sure. Nutri- nutri- you got your top nutritionist. You got all these guys that are all o- their only focus is to like make this player better and give this yeah. player like his absolute, which is like, I mean, that's why when Jason Kelsey just retired, he had that, um, his guy, the guy that taped his ankles for him. Remember the guy mm. that taped his ankles yep. and he goes, tape my ankles one more time for the, cause I guess, um, supposedly that guy had cancer and he couldn't be there for his oh, last wow. game. So he's going through uh, radiation, uh, chemotherapy. Mm-hmm. You're making a guy with cancer tape your ankles? No, the guy was a trainer <laughs> okay. for them, and he taped his All ankles. Right. And his last game that he, the guy couldn't be there because he ended up getting cancer yes. and had to go for his radiation treatment. And you, he thought that the nice thing to do for like was, a little celebration. No, was the to guy say, tape my ankles. One more. <laughs> the guy, I, the guy said, "I couldn't be there for your last game." He let goes, me tape your ankles. He one said, last time. <laughs> oh, <laughs> "He goes, he's, he's like, I can't get over this." <laughs> And you go, no, tape his ankles for his retirement speech. So you got to say, like... Oh, that's hey, pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. Like, you got to do my, my last, yeah. you know. I think that's cool. Yeah, that's awesome. You know what yeah. I mean? Because, like, don't, don't, like yeah. you're a part of the team at that point. Sentimental yeah. moment. Yeah, I agree. You don't give a fuck, eh? You're he, not a sports he, guy. He's no. not. He's a weird sports guy. Tape my ankle one last time, brother. <laughs> <laughs> tape me up one last time. <laughs> <laughs> for this press conference, is about to get intense. <laughs> <laughs> right as soon as it's done, get it off! <laughs> God, you did it tight today. <laughs> <laughs> Couldn't feel my fucking right foot that whole time. I'm fucking washed up. <laughs> fucking you missed one fucking game and you're fucked. I watched Talladega. Get out of here. I watched Talladega Nights and then immediately I was like, fuck it. I've been watching a lot. The last, swear to God, the NASCAR season just started. Watched all the races so far. Nice. Really? Yeah, I have. Really? Just because I, 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 there was a guy at work talking about it and he was like, listen. He goes, it's Daytona 500. It's one of the biggest races. He goes, watch it one time. And he goes, if you don't like it, you never have to watch it it's again. It's a good race. I watched it. I watched it. That last God, lap. Damn, those cars go fast. Like, <laughs> <laughs> and holy shit. Them <laughs> fuckers go fast. Dude, yeah. the, how close they are and like how like just the slightest movement yeah. could fuck them up. Dude. F1 is crazy. I, I've never. I'm, they're not just left turn, left turn. They're left turn, right turn, right turn, right turn. Left right turn, yeah. Like. Well, because NASCAR isn't like that as well. Mm. Like NASCAR has the ovals, right? Yeah. 
but like they do have some of those tracks where it's like the fucking they got like, a little yeah. fucking swerve in they them. got a little swerve in them yeah. but i was like i started watching it and then i watched talladega nights then i fell in love with it even harder yeah. and i was like fuck it because i love that movie dude it's talladega nights is yeah. such a fucking good movie yeah. oh my god yeah i agree if you ain't first, you're fucking last. <laughs> do you know? Do you love that opening scene of Reese Bobby driving? She's like, uh, "You drove past the hospital," and then after yeah. you go, go 165, right? <laughs> and, he goes, and he goes, "We're going 165." Here we go, and then she goes, "Oh my god, it's coming out!" <laughs> like, you know? Right, and check. He just breaks that bitch. <laughs> And he goes, I'm a, remember career day? I love that. He goes, this, oh, I'm here for career day. And then after he walks in, he goes, so I'm a semi-professional race car driver and a volunteer fireman. <laughs> 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 Both cool things to me. <laughs> I love, I was telling him, I love the scene where Ricky Bobby comes back and he's like, you know, his dad's trying to teach him again. And his dad's like, listen, you got to drive with the cougar in the car. <laughs> There's a cougar in the car. You gotta face fears, Ricky. He goes, listen. If and he goes, oh, grab the handle like that. And he goes, that, that was too quick. That was too quick. No, he goes, you gotta get in there. Be calm with the cougar. You gotta be calm with the cougar <laughs> yeah, in the car. Yeah. Or another one is just like when he's driving blind. You don't need goes, your eyes to drive, he goes, baby. He goes, you feel, he goes, do you feel the? Ro- what, tell me what you feel, Ricky. Tell me what you feel. He goes, I feel, I feel the warmth of the wood steering wheel. The rumble of the engine. The rumble of the engine. <laughs> and he goes, you feel that. And put her yeah, drive. He goes, yeah, he goes, put it in drive now. <laughs> <laughs> it goes right through the house. <laughs> it hits like three cars. <laughs> three cars goes right through the house. Does his driving test with the cougar in the back. <laughs> <laughs> now, why don't we go enjoy this nice family, okay, at Applebee's. <laughs> oh, man. Well, that's how the conversation started was Applebee's. <laughs> Was from Applebee's, yeah. yeah and then we went. Have you guys ever been to an Applebee's? Yeah. No, actually. Yeah. What? Nope. No, never once have I been inside. I've of driven, an by, like driven by it the a one thousand on times. Like, yeah, yeah. exactly. Easily. What, what is it? What's it there. like in there? It's too hot. Had better. Yeah. Could have better. Yeah. Yeah. How is that place still open? I don't know. How is that place what? still open? I okay. Say we're all chill. <laughs> I wouldn't be like, yo, let's, let's go. Let's go to Applebee's. Like three dollar apps. Yeah. <laughs> There's never been one time our group's been like, we should hit that. Let's hit Applebee's yeah. today. We used to fucking, if we were hungover, God, we'd hit fucking uh, Buffalo Wild Wings. Oh, remember yeah. That? Oh, yeah. Li- Three pitches of water we, for the we table. Wake up, <laughs> we wake up at 10. We show up at 1045. We know that bitch opens at 11. We're sitting in the car. <laughs> <laughs> sitting in the car, hungover, waiting for Buffalo Wild Wings to be open. As soon it hits 11, we're first the first ones. first ones in there. They're like, oh, shit, some people are in here. And then we sit down. I remember I was like, hey, listen, we all need pitchers. Pitchers of water. That's what we need. She goes, oh, rough night last night. And I was like, very, very, very rough, bro. <laughs> but she was on that shit. Yeah. She brought like so many pitchers of water, bro. She was <laughs> shout like, out that waitress. <laughs> oh, my God. No, for real. Shout out. I don't know. I know she's not working there anymore because it's closed down. Rest in peace. R.I.P. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hurt. Thank God. Yeah. He was actually happy about it shutting down. Really? Yeah. Didn't like it? I, I had nothing against it. Just they're not, it's a listen, blight in our city. I just liked how we did. We just went there, watched sports, and just chilled. The one thing yeah, I'll say about that like place, that that. and then I, anywhere, but. maybe you can attest because like you're a food guy too. Mm. Do you find like if you order out mm. from certain places, it doesn't hit as eating in a restaurant? Like oh. I guess you could say that from oh, most yeah. places, but yeah. there's places that I've ordered from, and I'm like, this hits, this hits. But like whenever I order from like a wing place. It does not hit if you're not it's sitting. Not sitting in the I you feel have, like delivery wings and will never compare to in house. You can't. Yeah. Because they get too soggy or yeah. something, yeah. bro. Like they sit, sit for the conversation too long. him and I had. Like, you make a sandwich and your mom makes a sandwich. Which is better? Your mom's sandwich. My mom's yeah. sandwich is better yeah. every time. Way I make better. it the every exact time. same way. Yeah. Step by step. Ass. <laughs> mom makes it. I agree with best that. Best sandwich ever. <laughs> yeah. It's like pasta, bro. I remember my grandfather can make this mean pasta. Like, I've never, seriously, best pasta I've ever had. No one's ever been able to come close to it. And every time I try, yeah. try so hard <laughs> to get close, and I'm disappointed almost immediately every time. No, no recipe? It's, there's like, it. Secret sauce. It's like, there is, <laughs> there is, but it's like, it's half a bottle of wine. It's like you, <laughs> there's something that I'm yes. not doing. There's something that like he did that I'm not like I'm missing. I'm missing a step. He didn't and clean he, his yeah. pots. He yeah, clean his pots yeah. at Fre- all. No, you gotta, well, how are you gonna, you gotta let it marinate? Skill issue. How are you gonna let it? You gotta let your shit marinate. Yeah. yeah. Two, Skill issue. Three months. No. Skill issue. Yeah. yeah. Thanks, man. I knew you were gonna sign <laughs> that in there. <laughs> It is a skill issue. You're right. Yeah. Uh, but no, I wish I could fucking, you know. 
I wish I could. I can make good pasta, but it's just like that one is just, you know, you're it's never going to, it's just like, cause especially cause he's passed now. So it's like, you're never going to get that again. No. Yeah. And it's like one of those things I got robbed at 13. I know that that's all I know. <laughs> I got robbed of that. And I was so fuck. I'm pissed about it. I'm still mad, but it's like, Oh, I'm never going to be able to do that. You know no. what I mean? Mm-hmm. I will say I make a mean chicken delight though. Yeah. I make yeah. a mean chicken delight. With the sauce. With the sauce. Brother, I'm going to get chicken delights today. Yeah. Yeah. Honestly, thank you. Thank you for saying that. (laughs) We should get a nice order of penalty box. Oh, my God. I haven't had that in years. Penalty? Penalty box? When's the last time you had penalty box? Me? Personally? Yeah. Uh, It's the wrong answer if you didn't say September. Oh, I thought you said. I haven't since with you. I swear to God, oh, I thought you said, what else do you order from Penalty Box? And I was like, if you don't say chicken people, delight. People like, say they get other stuff <laughs> than the chicken delight. I'm like, why, why, why did you tell them? I did when I was younger. Go anywhere, anywhere else. You're wrong. <laughs> go anywhere else. <laughs> yeah. No. You're going to get something else than the chicken delight? Go somewhere else. Yeah. yeah. Real. yeah. Literally 2019, 2020 with you was the last time. Really? Yes. I don't even remember the last time I had a chicken delight. I got it for graduating. I want to say 2021. <laughs> I want to say 2021. Maybe I, you're right. I was probably 2015. Very early. 2015? Yeah, 2015, 2014. Tyler, you've been robbed of that? I was for so long. So long. Yeah. It's been nine years, you son. You should go. <laughs> you should go like today. You should go today. Go. You should go today. Quick little uh, snack. Little mange. <laughs> little mange. <laughs> little mange. God, they're not Sheesh. open on the Lord's Day. <laughs> <laughs> they're not open on the Lord's Day, just like Chick-fil-A. They're not? No, nope. really. What? That's a I good know, business. I, I one time, I did go, and I was... I was pretty fucked up on a Sunday and I tried, <laughs> I, I tried to go, Shock. I go, I go there and I realize it's closed and I was oh. so upset yeah. and I was like, fuck, do you know, like it's tough. Even like that Chick-fil-A when you, if you do want Chick-fil-A on a Sunday, cause that's the only time I ever want it. Mm. There's no other time I want Chick-fil-A. I mm-hmm. still haven't had it, dude. It's, the same. Down Listen, the you know what I so Because happen. everyone, it is. It's not bad, but it, to be fair, it is just the same as every other fucking chicken place. Yeah. It is. Yeah. It is because the it's like I get that. The sauce. Yeah. Great. Right. Really. The sauce. Yeah. I didn't know that. Well. You're right. You couldn't get it there. The sauce, though. But what I just find is like you know people get especially around here they get hyped if you see like an American franchise open up here. Yeah. And what I've come yeah. to learn is. It's the portions people like. I don't think it's the quality. No. Portions is mad. Like, yeah. But, like, I feel like Western culture, too. Like, if you look at certain cooking, like, even if in European cooking, especially Western, it's just, it's they all mad. enough for yeah. one person. Yeah. <laughs> like, especially American the world cooking. makes enough for one person. Uh, American cooking is like, let's load this guy's plate up. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. But, like, I find with, like, European, like, if even when you want to say fine dining, it's like, oh shit. Like this is the like I read a thing today where it was like a Harvard professor said you should only eat like a certain amount of fries per day or a, a serving of fries like six fries is a serving. And Fuck I'm like no. I need not at least close, close, four or five servings. I need, like, yeah. add, add, <laughs> like add a zero to the like sixty give me sixty yeah, fries. Like, what, are, what, are <laughs> what are we doing? No, we're talking. Those rookie numbers. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I'm eating fucking guys. pork. I'm eating what? fucking eight. Man, portions. Portions. <laughs> the bottom of the bag, maybe. I don't know. Especially you mean for carbohydrate. I'm a for, glutton. For the Fuck. ketchup I use, I need a bit, <laughs> need a bit. <laughs> more ketchup than fries. Yeah. yeah. For real. Yeah. Yeah, you're shit. Yeah, heavy ketchup. My kryptonite. My kryptonite. Yes, sir. It's just too good. You uh, like tomatoes, though? No. Shalom. Yeah, you mean neither. No, but I'll just, no, I was going to say I'll drink ketchup. That's a step too far. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm, a scoop I'm not a ketchup guy. <laughs> scoop. Really? A scoop. You know what? I don't mind it. Was I it? had a tomato sandwich recently. Just a fucking bread and tomato. Damn good for you, bro. Dude, it was Sidney Crosby. Good, good, bro. Okay, <laughs> hear me out. Toast, butter, mm-hmm. mayo if you fuck with it. Yes. L- uh, lettuce, tomato, salt, pepper. Nothing yes. better. My grandma eats that every morning, bro. Good. I used that to have that for lunch every yeah. day, dude. <laughs> That's like got to be a grandparent meal, 100. Oh, percent yeah. It's the oh, fucking salt so and pepper, good. dude. It's the salt, it's the salt and pepper. I'm delicious. telling you. You lost me at butter and mayo. <laughs> okay, don't really? Mayo. You're just not a mayo guy. No, I'm a mayo guy. Are I'm you? a huge mayo not a guy. Just not a, uh, not a butter guy. Butter, hey, you ever had mayo toast? No. Just no. toast with mayo on it. That's Give it a so shot. British. Give it a shot. Uh, <laughs> Chase eats to live. He doesn't eat for the taste of shit. Gotta get my new. One day you're one day you're hanging out with the guys. The only thing you have is bread and mayonnaise. I'd eat it. I'd eat it. Yeah. I'd eat it. Yeah. 
Tyler, Let, I'm telling you right least. now, okay. we liked it so much, we bought two more loaves of bread. So we went to the store. <laughs> we could have got anything else, but we were just like, let's get two more loaves of bread. We got the mayo at home already. And we slammed back three loaves of bread that day. <laughs> That's <laughs> fucked. That's, That's crazy. It's a lot of bread. It's a lot of bread. You dude. bloated at all, probably? Oh, yeah. No, yeah. I was Thanks, not bro. feeling well. well Do you guys fuck with wieners and beaners? Uh-huh. Like hot, like dogs, kid, hot dogs and beans. I feel like as a oh, kid, yeah, I yeah. Did. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it is good. Actually, I do it like baked good. beans. I do yeah. really. Like yeah. yeah, baked beans isn't the wrong ever. Yeah. You ever had fucking oh, fuck cut up hot dogs and eggs? No. What? Sure. It's weird. That Listen, sounds so good. I like both those things. Yeah. Both those things, but together it was weird for me, man. It was weird for me. She threw like peppers in there and shit. It was weird. Did taste great though. Never gonna make it for myself, obviously. But what if it's there? <laughs> if it's there. Obviously. If it's there. If someone. I've never liked me cooking yeah. hot dogs and eggs. Yeah. Let's fuck. <laughs> I'll <laughs> crack some eggs I'll and throw some dogs in her butt. <laughs> You're like, I'll eat it. I'll eat it. Yeah. I'll eat uh, it. I'll get after it. I feel like as an older man, like as an adult, I'd put bread around it. I'd make that a sandwich. Yeah. Yeah. I'll put some ketchup on it too. Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. Definitely. Shocker. Shocker. Yeah. Yeah. But do you do you have ketchup with your eggs? Because uh, I know people do that. Yeah. I'm not a ketchup guy at all. No, I do, I, I, I do ketchup with the eggs. I, I do. prefer hot sauce. Zach, but yeah. I might lose you here, buddy. So. I might lose everybody here. Ketchup with my pickles. No. Oh, I mean, that works on every burger ever, so that kind of doesn't Dude, make sense. I'm not a pickles or a burger. Out of my way. Or if I'm eating burger. a pickle, I'm getting ketchup. ketchup and I'm dipping that. It's not like the weirdest thing, but it's like, I don't think I do it I wouldn't prefer on purpose. It. Yeah. Dude, it's gas. Yeah, no. Like, like, cause like, if I have a grilled cheese and I have like a sliced pickle and it somehow lands in That's my ketchup, how I it. I'll eat it. it. Yeah. Okay, that makes yeah. sense. That I got you. Okay, now yeah. if I lose you here for real, popcorn and ketchup. No, you no. Lost me. we're done. We're wrapping. Up. I mean, like, uh, everyone say their last like, ketchup. But, or, like, what, now that I, just, I would never put it on top of the popcorn ever, ever, because I'm not a serial killer. Yeah. But take popcorn, put a little dollop of ketchup on the side, and do a little dunk, dunk. I can see where you're coming. I've done the powder on it. Just thinking about it, it's like ketchup chips almost. Yeah. Yeah. I could see it's it. It's pretty bad. fucking good. Yeah. It's pretty good. I used to eat, I'm never like, gonna I used try. to eat ketchup. <laughs> I used to yeah. eat cucumbers with ketchup. Really? Cucumbers? I, was young, I can't I was, even. I was like eight or nine. I can't even like uh, imagine that taste. I yeah, can't. I, I can't. Yeah. It's I, actually, I actually don't even mind uh, it. I feel like it might be because, good. Well, like my mimi used to give me like just the absolute plate of cucumbers with my chicken strips and ketchup just somehow got Bro, the when's the last time you just had some that. chicken strips? It's been a while. Literally a long two time, days yeah. ago. Good for you. Good <laughs> Dude, for you. It's been a while. I love, I swear to God, I love a diner's yeah. chicken fingers and fries. Like a yeah. good yeah. diner. Yeah. I'm oh, I, do too, I yeah. love the chicken fingers. I love personally that Hungry Wolf place, bro. Yeah. Ball. I didn't chicken even know they fingers, had bro. that shit. Bro, they give you fat chicken fingers. They give you a fuck ton too. Yeah. Like you're you're like, dude, am I paying this much for chicken fingers and fries? But when you get it, yeah. you're like, holy fuck, this has chicken good. fingers and fries, yeah. bro. <laughs> oh my god. Nice. Like they're bomb. They're so good. Fries I'm trying no taste though. Yeah, you can make the what? Fries. The fries have no fucking taste. I like the fries. She doesn't like them. I like them. I, got I like them. Like the little wedge ones? Yeah. Yeah. No, they're good, man. I love yeah, seasoning. It's on them, all potato y on the inside. And they, they don't are, like salt they are or anything. They are potatoes. On them. Oh, I, t- uh, I just throw I salt out of myself. Salt, yeah. Yeah. See, I put salt and pepper on like there almost you. everything. I, I have so many <laughs> seasonings at my house. I'll just throw it. Like, if I get that, I'll just season like whatever I have. What do you got? Yeah. yeah. I don't season anything. No? <laughs> I like tell. your food, that the foods that you get? Uncultured swine. I don't, <laughs> <laughs> I don't care for it. No? What, the seasonings? No, no. Just, just use salt and pepper, dude. I don't like using salt. No, just use pepper. Salt bloats you. God, I love, I love pepper, dude. I think pepper might be my thing. I like pepper, though. I Pepper's like pepper. where it's at. I love pepper. I don't even want to know what pepper is. I'm pepper That's heavy pepper in my is. mac and cheese. Yeah, what? Yeah. Pepper heavy in my mac yeah. and don't cheese. Don't ask. I don't want to know. I don't want to know, Zach. <laughs> Put it up. <laughs> I'm putting it up. I yeah, I, I feel like it's it's something simple. What? Like I feel like I'm overthinking it. Whatever pepper oh, is. It's yeah, it's just what I say. It's a plant. Yeah. Fire. Is it good though? for you? I have pepper. Heard. I heard pepper actually helps with gut absorption. I heard that. Yeah, well, I'm slamming that shit yeah. even harder now. What I've, were you saying? Right? I've heard if you get really, really high and you don't want to be high anymore, and you just take like a like the black pepper thing and you crunch, you crunch on it, your high goes away. Hmm. I heard if you just stub the shit out of your toe, it uh, cancels all the effects out. <laughs> if you eat pepper, <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, like, if you're just high as shit, just fucking slam your oh, foot into stop. a wall and oh, you'll be well, good. You're fucking well. You'll be on a whole different thing there. It's yeah. a berry. <laughs> What's up, sorry? It's a berry. Oh, interesting. So what? It gets dried out and then crushed. I'm assuming. Yeah. Dried out into the pellets, and then that's why you can either have the crusher. I would like to taste it not dried out. 
Not dry. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Be just like yeah, Because be yeah. there isn't there even like white pepper? Fl- uh, yep. yeah, yeah, something yep. like that. Yeah, pepper, right? Pink, yep. green. Hang on. Yeah, see, there's green, pink, white, black. Montauk white. Wow. Hmm. Yeah. Do you think they taste different? Or you think it's? I don't know. See, that's what I mean. I don't I know. I feel like it probably would taste. You like ask like someone who actually knows shit, they'll be like, "I could taste the difference right I away." <laughs> like, I can, I can tell you. Lion fool me right now. I'll tell you what color this pepper is. <laughs> Paul Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> yeah. 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 His fucking palate. He fucking be able to tell every yeah. everything that you put in that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> He'd be like, "Did you pick this with your hand? Like, do you like he would know that <laughs> shit." Cause like these have, these these peppercorns have only been dried for three hours. They're supposed to be dried for sixteen. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. He would know that shit. You're right. Because we've been watching a lot of Hell's Kitchen mm-hmm. recently, and Good it's show. like the last ch- yeah the last challenge that we watched was like each team had to make a dish or some shit, and he was like trying to show how good his palate was, like tell them what they did, and they were like, oh my god, yeah, and right. one of the best challenges on that is when they have to test the fucking other people's palate Mm -hmm. and like it's totally off like someone's eating an apple they're like oh yeah a fucking (laughs) like chicken hair (laughs) chicken (laughs) yeah they're like chicken like what was one that was crazy there was one that was like i think someone said potato like there was a potato like potato pretty simple and they were like yam and you're like oh fuck (laughs) like a yam (laughs) the consistency of a potato and a yam might be similar under certain conditions Dude, there was one they he gave him a little nugget of chicken and they were like beef yeah beef because chicken and beef are totally different totally Totally different bro yeah Yeah, totally different i mean uh, even we we tried it and then i was like i could fucking i I know the difference i could tell (laughs) the difference right away to be fair i gave you some fucking easy ones i gave you heavy hitters we gave easy ones because we were like there a lot of them kept saying if you're blind because you're blindfolded and have the headphones and they're like oh it's a lot harder than people think so then we blindfold ourselves and try to do it and Mm. we got it the amount of time like free time you have is amazing it's insane yeah. <laughs> I was like fuck we gotta fucking take a look at this I rain. can tell you don't work <laughs> yeah. I'm not working 60 tell you unpaid really hours work, bun. <laughs> look at my hands <laughs> 60 unpaid still dirty yeah yeah you worked fucking what'd you do today 16 unpaid at labor 16 unpaid labor right here <laughs> yeah before 9am before 9am <laughs> yeah, make that money man make that money <laughs> yeah that's what I always love about Chase he lets me know how much he works when he comes in here <laughs> Yeah. Some things never change. <laughs> <laughs> they don't. <laughs> oh man. Oh man. But what the like? You're a cook. Yeah. What got you into cooking? Honestly, because my uncle owned the restaurant in Windsor. We still. Do What's this. the restaurant? Shout it out. Artisan know- Grill. You know, it's in Amherstburg. Nice. They had one out in um, the mall. I was working there. I got in there, and then I started just watching the chefs there cook. And I was like, oh, I like this. Like, I want to learn this. Like, I want to learn how to cook for myself. And I just fell in love with it. Like, fell in love with, like, the different tastings of How food. many times have you tried to serve your friends raw stuff? Never. No, okay. Never. Right, never. Our friend tried to do that to us. Are Ten minutes serious? after telling me he wanted to become a cook. What the fuck? On purpose <laughs> he did that? No, not no, on purpose. No, oh, no. Yeah. He proceeded to drop them in uh, wood sawdust. shavings. And then try to serve it again. After he... What? <laughs> we were in the garage. Who would? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's Sorry to interrupt. Uh, it was just... There's some fighting words right there. Yeah. Well, it's, <laughs> he was trying. Yeah. He was really trying. Was it's really funny because Chase he, goes, "Listen, man, we'll just order Simon's." Like, we'll <laughs> like the first time the they Simons. came off the grill, they were raw. So it was like, you know, just put them back on, cook yeah. them through. Yeah. But then he dropped them all in the sawdust, and then still was trying to serve it. It's like it's over, dude. Yeah, it's you gotta over. do that. You yeah. gotta. Yeah. Do it. <laughs> it's over. Oh, well, he goes, off. "I spent money on this." <laughs> oh, it was a really sad. Mm. We were all standing sad, there. Yeah. It now that the wait for the burger. Oh yeah, we know we waited for a bit. <laughs> <laughs> like we were waiting a while. I was playing Wii bowling. Yeah. I was trying to. Just Let me tell you though, the the, the the little, oh little piece I had that didn't touch sawdust, it tastes it's good. good. It would have been a good burger. <laughs> would have been decent. Yeah. yeah if it wasn't What's your like sawdust? favorite thing to cook? Like, what do you? My favorite thing? Yeah. Anything that has to do with pans, so like seafood, pastas. Like I love that stuff. Pasta is mm. probably the easiest thing to cook, honestly. Um, You'd be surprised in Hell's Kitchen. <laughs> fucking mush. He's <laughs> 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 all the time. But uh, I think the hardest thing to cook is probably meats. Yeah. Like your proteins, very hard. Very, very well, hard. But once you learn them. Once you learn good. them, it's easier. I get that. But I can't wrap my head around it. Really? It's yeah. still like a struggle for you? It's a little, yeah. It's something I want to learn more on. What What do you mean? Like in the sense of the curing or in the sense of like medium, medium rare? Uh, medium, like I, got the, I got the cooking down right. But yeah. I'm just like the way like. 
it's so hard to explain but like how like di- like different cuts have to be cooked at different temperatures yeah like different like like different thickness in each different uh cut has mm. to be taken off at some time like has to be sitting for a certain amount of time has to be like after it's done cooking has to be sitting for a amount of time and if like it's too soon or too late totally off yeah and yeah, it's so right. like it's hard to get there yeah yeah Gotta i like would sh- like to learn that <sighs> do you like is all your thing just self-taught uh yeah like like, I'll ask. like i know you said you have an uncle so i'm assuming yeah. you, uh, most of the things you got is from him from him yeah yeah he he was like a, a really big chef out west at one of like the resorts out there he was working at and then i learned a lot from him um and then honestly just like working with other people who are chefs around me that are certified chefs just ask them questions like well how does like how does it do this why is it this why is it that how you do this how do you do that and then it's just trial and error from there a lot of it what that's what i've learned it's a lot of trial and error. it's a lot like it's yeah. a lot of fail like you got to be okay with failing in cooking like yeah. i've i've made yeah. a few things where I... it's just like yeah, but you fucking eat mayo I'm toast. I'm never gonna <laughs> like the, never gonna attempt. If you fuck up mayo toast, then we gotta. <laughs> He's talking it. all this stuff. I'm like, mm, nah, it's me. never gonna be me. Yeah, not me. <laughs> well, yeah. it's never gonna be you. But like, I just I do find it interesting. Where you're right, it is like if you don't if you fuck up one thing in meat, it yeah. could be it could be the end. It set it off, yeah. Or like you said, especially like baking, bro. Baking, you have to be exact. I can't bake. Yeah. Don't baking, you have to be bake. exact. Yeah. She's been taking up baking, and she's good at it. Like, for her, That's just awesome, picking yeah. it up, All she's those cookies good. you guys had the one day, or mm-hmm. yeah, two days. Yeah, those are bomb. Fantastic. Yeah. She, made, she made brownies this morning. Bomb. Yeah, I ate but one I before made, I came here. I made brownies this morning, and, like, the like the first step is, like, melted butter and then sugar, and then you, like, beat that a little bit. Yep. Um, and then you add, like, the flour. You add, like, all the dry shit. Bro, I beat the, the fucking butter and the sugar for, like, 30 seconds too long. Fucked it up. Yeah, see, it's an entirely different they came hard thing. Like, they yeah. came out bomb Did for me. Taste <laughs> yeah, I taste them. They swear, I swear to God, they came out bomb. I love brownies. They look though. like squishies, though. Really squishy. They were good. They were delicious. Yeah. Did least, they have a good consistency? Yes. That's what she's asking. Yeah, that's Thank good. You, I'm telling you, they're good. I'm fuck. <laughs> Does not care if they're good or not? But, they, <laughs> but it is. It's like if you add a little too much of like butter or Anything, something, you're yeah. fucked. You're fucked right away, bro. Those are like gotta throw it all out. That's what I like about it. It's yeah. a lot of with like cooking, bro. But like, nerd. <laughs> <laughs> keep her humble. You gotta keep her humble. Keep her humble. Guys, I dropped out of college. I'm this guy's like, I'm <laughs> <laughs> me too. Me too. I graduated college. Same there. Me three. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Who would have thought I'd be the only <laughs> girl that's graduated in the room? No one. <laughs> Can't say when you haven't gone. <laughs> <laughs> cheers, brother. <laughs> hey, oh, uh, yeah. Cheers to that, dude. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I cheated. It wasn't really college. <laughs> <laughs> I got the certificate, though. The fast track. Bro, you can't trust that shit now. There's doctors that are doing their shit on chat GBT. Fuck that. You can't trust a someone that's doing <laughs> chat GBT trying to pass They passed the test. They can't. I can't. You're all of a doctor's our age. Like, if a doctor, like, I'll be like, how old are you? And they're like 29. I'll be like, let's get somebody who's been a veteran. Like, let's. Mm, I need some things. I need someone like, oh, you're fresh. Like, if someone says, oh, I'm 28, I'm like, you're fresh. You're new. I yeah. can't. Let, yeah. Give me a doctor that's been a doctor. Oh, where's the doctor? doctor? 29 years. <laughs> where's the actual doctor? Yeah. I want some guy that has a couple years under his belt. Yeah. Like, you know what I, yeah. I want the guy closer to retirement, like right on the edge. Yeah. I want that dude who has been like, cup. We didn't do, used to do the surgery back then. Like, I want. <laughs> I want that. That's what I want. I want. I never done this surgery like this before. <laughs> yeah, a lot yeah. more safety precautions than there used to be. That's my guy. Yeah, that's what I. That's <laughs> who I really want. But yeah, that guy's learning by trial and error. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you want to talk about learning through trial and error? Fuck. That guy got, that it, guy that got it, bro. That guy got it. But yeah, no, like I don't know, man. I'm still learning. I'm still learning. I like I said. I think we should do something. Yeah. Yeah, we should cook yeah. something up. I'm down to do that. You got the proteins, I got everything else. Bet. <laughs> <laughs> I'll do the proteins. I need to learn. Cool. I have no idea. Oh, yeah. oh, just no do idea. you just like truthfully, do you just not want to do it or do you just not know how? Uh, or do you just not like how. the or do you not like the process in general? Cuz people may just not like the pro- like people don't like handling meat. I think people he just don't doesn't like know where to start. He just I've like, never yeah. touched meat. Yeah. We you should never touch meat in your life. Liar. Never touch <laughs> meat. <laughs> not a meat beater. No. Uh, yeah. Keep it no, no, I'm just uh, <laughs> I just cook my eggs, bro. Just eggs, that's just it. Just eggs, really. It's like, a lot of protein in there too, yeah. There is a lot of protein in there, yeah. but I can cook some good eggs. Like I've I've cooked them enough to where like I don't know, I think I'm pretty you good. Cook some egg, eggs. Egg. <laughs> yeah, like, there you go. At least the way I like it, I it's, it's proper. Yeah. How do you like your like eggs? Fantastic. I like over easy. Yeah, 
It's a proper for way. sure. Yeah, it's a proper way. Proper yeah. way. Believe it or not, side up Scram- scrambled's okay. I can't too. do scrambled. It tastes like fucking when I, wet. When dog. I fuck up, <laughs> that's when I'm doing scrambled. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm never yeah. setting uh, out to do scrambled, but eventually it does become scrambled. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I think <laughs> sunny side up's gross. Yeah, personally, I don't I know. Like it's kind of it. raw to me. Where do you get yours? I get raw. Yeah, I understand that. Uh, well, the only time I ever get them from anywhere, if I'm making them myself, it's scrambled every time. But if I'm getting them from somewhere, it's on an Eggs Bunny, so it's over yeah. easy. Yeah. See, you I'm know what I've been craving guy. recently nope. on the egg thing? Omelet. Delicious. Yeah. I love a good, a good omelet. A good omelet with some shit in there, some peppers, some cheese and shit. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I know what you're saying. Yeah. Mm. Ketchup? <laughs> yeah. No. For real. Yeah. Dessert? Yeah. Yeah, no, I'm not an egg guy. No? I, I like I the used, texture, though, right? I used to be... Yes, and you know what? You can vouch for me on this one because, like, I did try for a long time to eat eggs. I really did. I One tried the them a bunch of different way, protein. yeah, and all that. W- and I just I couldn't get just over blend the text. Up. I just couldn't get over the texture. Blend the shit out of it. There's not like bananas. You can't eat bananas either, right? Banana? No, bananas fuck my whole digestive system. Banana up. a day. Banana a day. I can't have the. Ba- <laughs> 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 That's why I take potassium pills. I yeah, just take potassium go, pills. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I did do too. Yeah, yeah. I can't I can't do banana because it fu- <laughs> it fucks my whole digestive system up. Shout out to Jeff Reed. <laughs> Jay Reed, yes sir. <laughs> Je- Jeff Reed gave me that information. <laughs> Je- yeah, he's the one who told me. Banana <laughs> day. Keeps the rod all up. <laughs> <laughs> he's like Mickable Baltras and Potassium. <laughs> Dude, that thing dude, going woke, at- dude woke up at what, like 5.30 p.m. today? Went <laughs> straight to the fucking garage and breakfast beers. Yeah. Walked yeah. out with shorts. Legend. It's cold outside. It's the only one way to know. Walk outside in shorts. <laughs> yeah. Dude, that's how you got to find out, dude. As yeah. a man, you just got to find out. I like how, like, no man will trust the weather, like, on the Oh, no, I never <laughs> like, let me walk outside. I gotta t- <laughs> Every time I'm like, let me walk outside. I'll A couple let you minutes out there, just like. Yeah. I risk this outfit. <laughs> if it's too hot, I take off layers. If it's too cold, I deal with it. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Yep. I think, like, especially, too, as a guy, when you get cold, you just have to be, like, committed to being cold. <laughs> like, you do. <laughs> too late now. I already left the house. <laughs> especially if we went downtown or something in the middle of fucking October. Deal with it. And we were like, well, we deal can't wear it. How are we deal supposed to wear it. a sweater and break it down? Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah. I'm going to sweat my ass off. Well, that's why we drink ever. enough to be warm. Yeah. <laughs> I've never yeah. worn a coat downtown, I don't think. Like you said, nah, just get drunk. We, never, we always leave in the in the car. In the car, middle yeah. of October, just in a button up, just yeah. fucking smoking darts and hitting joints darts, outside. Yeah. <laughs> I've never went downtown wearing Not a jacket, cold. but I've left wearing one. This dude's uh, <laughs> this dude just a couple times gangster, <laughs> real gangster. shit, yeah. bidding for fucking jackets with homeless people. <laughs> 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 he was yeah for the God. first one. Yeah, one that the is how I tell him it. the story. You never oh, okay. Tell him it. So we're downtown. Homeboy's fighting with his girlfriend, so I was like, oh, we're not going to leave for a bit. So I saw a homeless guy down the street, and he was yelling about something, so I went over there. I gave him a cigarette. We're talking for a while, and then I noticed there's this fucking crumpled up thing on the ground. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> was some kid threw this jacket at me. It was like a nice denim jacket. Okay. Like, I kind of always wanted one of those. Yeah. I was like, I'll give you two bucks for that. He goes, oh, it's kind of nice. I'm like, I'll give you two bucks and another cigarette for that. <laughs> So I got a hundred and seventy five dollar Tommy Hilfiger jacket off a homeless guy. Sheesh. Wow. Win nice. win situation. Right there, so yeah. now I'm walking down the street with his jacket on. Yep. I've told this story so many times, yeah. but that's fine. I got a chick on my back because her feet hurt. I see two probably crackheads eating pizza in one of those door frames that they camp yep. out in. Yep. We're standing by a red light. I'm like, what kind of pizza is that? It happened to be my favorite kind. So I was like, okay, I'll give you two dollars for two slices. <laughs> So now me and the chick are both eating pizza from crackheads. So we're going <laughs> to the, sh- the casino. Clothed and fed by crackheads. Love well, you know, I would have kept the two for myself. <laughs> Fuck the girl on my back. I'm doing the work. I need the felt energy. Bad. I need the energy. Yeah. <laughs> I couldn't hold them both and carry her. <laughs> and I couldn't just be like, here, hold this for me. You're like, hold two. Drunk <laughs> chick, <Yeah>. hold this. <laughs> Give each one to me. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, she's holding it like this. Yeah. Oh, so now we're in the Chino, and I see this guy wearing a cowboy hat, and I'm like, I need that. But I have no funds left. I've spent the last of my dollars <laughs> <laughs> on crackheads items. Uh, so Jake uh, almost fought the guy in the casino so I could get the hat. True Thanks. friend. I remember. That. I don't even think he knows what it was really about. No, <laughs> I do. So I'm going to tell you I don't think he really part. knew what was going on. I yeah. remember this part. This is for me. Now, yes, I was drinking, but <laughs> I came out. Could have guessed. 
Could have guessed. <laughs> <Could've> guessed. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Zach. And then, so I, we go, we decide we're going to go to the Chino. Mm-hmm. We go to the Chino. I'm already winning, so I was like, we're going. I'm hammered <laughs> into the, I'm hammered going into the Chino, and I decide I have to take a mad piss. Yep. So I go to the bathroom. Now, I said, where are you going to be? He goes, I'm going to be by Legends, by the bar, before they did all those renovations. Yep. So he's over there, and I'm like, okay, perfect. So I go piss. I walk out. I see he's talking to a gentleman with a cowboy hat. Now, I think this is just his friend. Like, I don't know who it is. So I go, <laughs> and I was like, oh, shit. Like, I was like, nice cowboy hat, man. And I grabbed it. I put it on my head, and I looked at Chase. And then this guy turned around and just snatched it off my head. Like, I mean, like, when he snatched it, he went like like that and hit me in the side of the head. Oh, wow. And I was like, bro, what the fuck are you doing? And after he's like, it's my, and I can tell he's hammered. So this is where my tone changed, because I'm like, I can't mm. hit this guy. <laughs> So he goes, oh, it's my fucking cowboy hat. And I'm, like, <laughs> and I'm like, okay, man, it's not that deep, bro. Like, what do you fucking, like, what it's do you say? It's a cowboy hat you get from a case of beer. Yeah. It's a Budweiser cowboy It was just a Budweiser hat. cowboy hat. And this guy yeah, was like, was listen, good. they are right. I shouldn't have snatched it off his head. Yeah. But I thought it was a funny joke to be like, ah. Like, <laughs> oh, yeah. And this guy just took it to like. Legitimate. Legitimate. Yeah. Like, I'm it's because he was already offended that I had asked to buy it for 50 cents. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's and then I'm another wrong. guy just walked up and took it. And, and, like, I, <laughs> and I had no, and I had zero clue. <laughs> I had zero clue. So this guy, and then I was like getting in an argument with this guy, and right away his fr- his friend and then like some girl that was there was like, you know, he doesn't mean he doesn't want it. He's just yeah. drunk. He's having yeah. a good time. And I'm like, damn, bro, it's not that deep. Like, you know, it's a cowboy it's hat. It's cowboy hat, man. Yeah. It's a cowboy hat. But apparently, it was deep to him. And you know. He was wearing a nice suit that I'll give him that. It was weird. It was a weird outfit. He's wearing a suit and a cowboy hat. And it's like, buddy, who the f- what do you own? The Dallas Cowboys? What are you fucking doing here? Like, Jesus Christ. The boys. It'd be different if you won Fuck big the in the boys. casino, but you're yeah. drinking at Legends. Like, you're drinking you're at Legends. Legends. You're drinking you ain't at Legends with shit. a fucking suit and a fucking suit cowboy, cowboy hat. hat. Yeah. Fucking gamble. Like, let's at least play Come the part. Let's play the part. Yeah. You know what I mean? Let's play the fucking part. Yeah. Oh, man. You know? Like, that's... that, that like. I don't know. It was just like those. You miss me in my prime, man. It was a really? weird night. Yeah. I hear about it all yeah, the time. You really miss really, me. I, really I miss you in your it. prime, too, man. Oh, yeah. cool. like my re- Plus 300. The duo. Yeah. Okay, not that prime. No. <laughs> That's a I prime. see him in the gym during that prime. The prime. That was a different type of prime, though. He knows that. When I was over 300 fucking pounds. Just, oh, it was so sick. Oh, God. He, I remember my buddy Pat. I tell the story. Right <laughs> so my buddy Pat, I did, I did. so I lost a bunch of weight. Yep. And then after... Uh, so I put my weight loss. Remember, I put my weight loss progress on Instagram, and I was like, nice. "No, I'm just." I, I still got that screenshot. The last two years, I'm really happy about the progress I made. Blah blah. blah. It's just all that. Yep. And then my buddy Pat. I I don't know if you ever met Pat. I know this yeah, story. But my, you come my, with her. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Come yeah. Come yeah. Her my real good buddy Pat. We got to get him back on. Yeah. Real good buddy yeah. Pat. I like Pat. Yeah, he's a cool guy. And he goes, he's okay. He, like one of my best <laughs> friends. I gr- I grew up with him. You know, he's one of my boys. Yep. Calls me up. I swear to God, word for word, he goes. I just want to let you know. Um, I know all those people are telling you like you look good. You're like all these positive comments. I just want you to let you know you still look like shit. <laughs> <laughs> and he goes, I just want you to still know you still friend. you still look like garbage. Don't stop because these people are you know it's gonna get to your head. Don't think anything of this. Don't let your ego get in the way. Like he goes, that. you still look like shit. <laughs> and then I was like, thanks man for calling. He goes, no problem. And kind of <laughs> <laughs> I don't you know, expect anything less. Yeah. I know, you know, and that's the thing. I know he's being honest. Yeah. <laughs> and I know like that's the thing about Pat. He felt that in his heart. Yeah. He felt that in his heart and you'll be like, oh my Delete, delete the post. <laughs> <laughs> right then and there I should have. I'm like, oh God. He's, he's right. Fuck. <laughs> Everyone else saying they're all happy congrats man congrats everyone says he looks like he looks good ah oh, you piece of shit <laughs> that was a <laughs> fucking liar yeah. pat, pat sniffed that my ego was going up and he was like well i'll shut that shit down real fast. <laughs> I'll, yeah. I was, he was like i'll shut that down gotta remind real him. fucking gotta, fast yep. it's like a mom finding out you're having fun you know shut that down <laughs> shut that down real fucking quick can't uh, let that be happening <laughs> <laughs> i can't let that can't let this fuck walk around and be like you know he's smiling today fuck yeah. him <laughs> <laughs> wait that son of a bitch. <laughs> son of a bitch is I'm telling you, that's how it went. He was at, because he was still at the shop. So he called me while he was at the shop, cut somebody here. I just want you to know. You look like shit. You look like You shit. look like garbage over there. <laughs> Hangs up. He's been on this podcast two times now. Yeah. Both times. Just, it was, the first episode was us talking about food for an hour. Mm. 
Our highest, <laughs> our highest view. Highest episode. view count. <laughs> and then our second time was when we got into the new studio. He's probably like, what, the second or third guest when yeah. we got the studio. Down an entire bottle of tequila on air. Yeah. It was an hour Let's and do a, it. it was an hour and a half podcast. Wow. Dude's different. He uh wow, yeah. He doesn't remember we the went, last hour. That's cool. We went out <laughs> went after, after that. So we went to Johnny Shots after for your parents' fucking fiftieth. Oh yeah. Yes. <laughs> and Jeff we Denise, remember it? fucking He was fucked up. Yes. Yeah, Do you remember that waitress up. that we both know that had to cut him off? Remember, she had to cut him off. Yeah. She was like, I can't serve him anymore. Too much, yeah. Uh, yeah. Well. And I was like, just give him a water. He won't know the difference. And he didn't. He was like, this is fucking great. That's your go-to <laughs> move. That's yeah. your go-to move. My, my dad got cut off. Everyone got cut off that night. Dude, your, <laughs> dude, his dad was so upset that you couldn't leave with Denise. <laughs> like, oh. Oh, you can see the come with us. Yes. Yeah. So we're like, because Denise was going to bring, um, I think, your grandmother home. Your grandmother was going to. Was gonna, with, Yeah. Yeah, your grandma was there, and I think they were going to bring her home, w- and your sister was with them. Yeah. And then I remember it, Jeffrey it was trying to get into the cab. And then they were like, and Denise is like, no, no, you're going with Jake and Zach. And then he was like, what? Like he was just, <laughs> yeah. he was just yeah. like, what? why? What? And then after, I was like, you're coming with us, bud. And after, he was like, but I want to go. He just sees his wife leaving. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's 50th anniversary. It's all the man wants. Oh, man. It's all 50, man wants. 50th an- or whatever it is. 50th birthday. Yeah, and yeah, it's like, yeah, fuck yeah. it. And he's just like, oh. oh. His face oh. is like, he's always like this. <laughs> just disappointed oh. he doesn't get to leave. Doesn't remember it. Disappointed. <laughs> it. I remember he goes, you want a beer? He gave us all a beer. Had a dart. Goes opened his beer. Left. <laughs> My son, that was Never it. seen again. Goes to bed. Goes to sleep. And I'm that's, a, that's a bedside beer. Yeah. That's a bedside yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <That's a> be- <laughs> beer. I used to get made fun of for those all the time. <laughs> bedside Nothing beers? Yeah. They're proper. Well, um, you, you know, I get cut off in the garage. You guys would go to bed. I was like, well, now I got a drink in bed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alone. Alone. <laughs> Dude, he got me on the big beer kick. I was, I was whiskey mm-hmm. and tequila for so long. Couldn't mm-hmm. catch me drinking anything else. Now, you guys got me smashing be- beers. Love beers. Love beers. This is more chill. I was trying to explain. It's a, it's Listen, can anyone agree yeah. with me? Because I was trying to explain this to Rain. Is it not a saddest, like, it does not satisfy you more than when you are oh, drinking God, beers God. with the fellas and you say, like, say you go, right? I'm going to give you an example. Need a beer? <laughs> Bro, yeah. Tell me that it is not the most feel, satisfying thing. Yeah, it does feel good. As a guy, good. It is as good, a guy yeah. and then you're and I then you do this. Bumps. Look, this is your exact I tell you this is it. You'd be like, Yeah, give me another one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Right? Yeah, one sec. I was trying to, I was trying to explain that to Rain. I was like, there's no better fucking feeling than asking the <laughs> boys if they want a beer, beer when beers are finished. <laughs> there isn't. There isn't a fucking oh, better feeling, I bro. love it. Especially as a dude. Oh yeah. Hmm. Oh yeah, give me another fucking beer, bro. Yeah. Give me another fucking. Zach, do you need another water? Yeah, do you need water, bro? You need another yeah. water, Zach. Yeah. I need a beer. Another H2O. You want a can? Yeah. No, I can't. You can't, can't drink. Why you can't drink? drink. Uh, Doctor, I don't orders? actually. I don't even know if I actually can. No one told me I can't drink. I just. Well, let's find out. Can you drink after a gallstone bladder? Let's search. I searched it because like gallbladder Google's gonna tell doesn't us. have anything really to do with the digestion of alcohol. It just goes to your liver. Do you I'm want some sure. water for real, though? Yeah. Hold on. Let me get this though. Gallbladder? Yeah. Uh, it's best. You although a person, you can, can drink moderately. That's all I saw. After, <laughs> after recovery. Uh, there you go. How many days has it been? More than one? It's, it's been, been a week. It's been eight. It's been, it's been eight. eight. Oh, okay. get this guy up no, here. No, 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 no. We're waiting until St. Patty's Day. St. Patty's Day. St. Patty's Day. I'm sorry for St. Patty's Day. So, 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 you, so you can use the I'm whole thing at once. Are you actually? Oh yeah, you leave. I'm in for. I leave the day before St. Patty's Day. Damn. 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 What about this place? That sucks. Water? I do want one so bad. I've been craving one Just since one. Time. One never hurt. Oh, That's a right. lie. I'll do hey, one. This is peer pressure. This is not peer it's pressure. Not peer pressure. We're men. We searched it up. <laughs> <laughs> There's no peers here. Yeah. <laughs> Google gave us the Google answer. Give it the answer, yeah. yeah. He said, like I said, I've seen. How, how long is the it? recovery time after a gallbladder? Can you drink with like pneumonia? A month, I think. Yes, you can. Yes. I nearly died, but you can. You can. Look. He's here today. And I trust this more than a doctor. Well, they said I had pneumonia for months. <laughs> really? Oh, my God. Alex had to trick me to go to the fucking doctor. What? Yeah, I had to get tricked to go to the doctor. 
Really? Oh, yeah. No, because we were like ripping dabs hardcore. So it was just inhaling butane for a lot, a long oh, time. Yeah. So eventually I did get double pneumonia, and uh, he had to trick me into his car to go to the doctor. Are you happy about it? Well, I'm living now, so, so no. I'm happy about it. Thanks, bud. Cheers. Oh, wow. That's so nice. Yeah. How's the water, guys? <laughs> it's pretty good. Uh-huh. Yeah, it is pretty good. Actually, this water's hitting. Yeah, not bad. Eh? Oh. Yep. Yeah, well, I mean, it's because after a while, yeah, uh, I developed a Boston <laughs> accent, and it, uh, <laughs> it pissed him off. <laughs> that's, why, that's why he tricked me into it. Well, mm-hmm. what's uh, when was the last time we had a drink? A while ago. That, well, I the respect last time that. You uh, you took a shot with us on Jake's birthday, but that was like you, when yeah. was the last time you actually got drunk? Oh, a long time ago. <laughs> a long, long time ago. Been a week. Well, sorry, Good for you. Thank you. Good for you. <laughs> I want you all the time, like all the time. Whoa! What's that? Oh my oh, god! Oh, oh no! What's that? Jake, you dropped one. I huh? tripped. <laughs> I trip. Hold on, I trip. Oh, what? That's the best water you'll get right there. Yeah. It's like cigarettes. I'm just gonna fish my water first. Yeah. Like I, I <laughs> crave them hard. Got to get that water to the gallbladder. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not a doctor. <laughs> it did say. It said that uh, the gallbladder is like part of your digestive tract, but it doesn't metabolize alcohol, so it, it wouldn't affect it. But it is obviously just up to you. Oh, good. I should just get mine removed. Like right, if you don't need it. it. I don't even need it. Right. Yeah. You want mine? <laughs> what, two. What, I, what I honestly found very strange with it though because when i had gallstones with my gallbladder obviously they said to go on low fat diet and like watch what i eat and take care of that it's part of but now diet. that it's gone the doctor when he cleared me to go home or discharged me i guess was like yeah you can eat whatever you want i was like what he's like i'm not saying go have a burger and fries i, I like right out of the hospital but he said i could eat whatever i wanted but is that, that what you said before like the gallstones right like it's from like a diet of, because don't they say gallstones yeah, is from cholesterol like, and st- like caffeine? So dude, mm. to be honest, like my diet, like especially COVID, was when I was fasting. Yeah. So it was black coffee, and then I would drink water. Then I'd have eggs. This yeah. was like every day. It would just add up. So I man, imagine, stores about a thick bread. liquid that produces by the liver to help us digest fat. Huh. Okay. So it's no longer being used to help you digest the fat. So what is the doing it then? Do you think we fucking switch that up from our diet, like through evolution? You think what? Like the fat of the gallstones? No. Oh, mm, no. I see what you're saying, but no. Yeah, no, but you, no. No, it's like, like it helps saying, digest the, the fat, yeah. right? Because isn't there like uh, what do they call that? Like your appendix person, like your appendix was used for something before, but now it's like you don't even really need it, yeah. right? Yeah. Well, well like was, human evolution is what you're talking. That's about. what I'm trying to get yeah, at. Yeah. yeah. Is it, it like one it of those? Filtered out some stuff that. Uh, it's called, but if the appendix helped filter out certain, probably does, yeah. From when we were drinking water out of uh, you know puddles, I think and it's, it's <laughs> shit off the ground. Asking, <laughs> like the yeah. gallstones itself, I think it's that we've gotten weaker. Yeah. That's what I'm trying to get so, at. Yeah, like the reason we get uh, like gallstones is because we've gotten weaker, or they we're eating more fat. But like we in the last, do something about it. Right, but the one thing that we keep constantly bringing up is like over the last hundred years, diets have changed, right? Like in the sense, yep. in the sense of like what most people eat now, yeah, right? Because most people, like we said, we're like we'll eat from like restaurants and shit like that, and pro- the shit's probably not as good mm-hmm. as what we were eating back in the day. But what I'm trying to yeah. get at is, is that what's making it switch? Is that everything's so processed that it's like, yeah, you don't even need this because you're like you're just fucking either pissing it out or shitting it out or yeah. just going through your fucking body, right? Mm-hmm. Like, that's what I would imagine, right? Like, yeah. you're just evolving into things that you don't need oh, you're now. you're saying, like, why doesn't he right. need it anymore? Right, but when I'm... Tr- even, like, imagine when you drink water. If you go on vacation, they tell you to only get bottled water because don't drink the water from the tap because your gut yep. microbiome can't digest that. That's yeah, why... I like, I had, a, I had a guy who I used to work with from Albania, and he would go to Albania every year, and every year he gets severely sick from drinking the water yeah. or eating their type of food because it's totally different from, like, mm-hmm. he got used to the West to eating like that, yeah. went back and started eating actual, like, food, mm-hmm. and then was like, oh, I'm fucked. But we even had a girl, what was her name? Tyler's girlfriend, Rose Rosemane. Rose, yeah. Rosemane said that when she went back to Pakistan, she ate goat and... Ever since then, she switched back because really? what she was eating in the West versus 
now, yep. totally different. Totally different. Totally yeah. different. Yep. Totally different. But like that's what I think, right? Like mm-hmm. that's what I'm imagining is that it's totally different. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like you're you're just like you don't need it. Because mm-hmm. what did we just search up that the gallbladder helps yeah, what, just what digest fat? Yeah. It mm-hmm. stores bile and it helps digest fat. Hmm. It squeezes the bile into the small intestine through the main bile duct. The more fat we eat, the more bile the gallbladder injects to the digestive tract. So that makes sense. Low fat diet. I'm saying what yeah. happens yeah. though, like now that you don't have a gallbladder, like what's different? Where'd you, you go? You just don't be digest. Harder it's going to be harder for his body to digest fat. Okay. Yeah. Is it cause Fiber. Does so it call you pain at all? Like, do you know that? I've been fine since. Yeah. I had it's, Simons. It's been a week, though. You've had yeah. Simons? Had you're Simons. good. Yeah, I wouldn't worry about anything else. Yeah. He's had McDonald's last yeah. night. He had two McDoubles. I had four oh, pieces of pizza. Oh, you're good. <laughs> I had four <laughs> pieces of pizza today. Yeah. Oh, buddy, you're moving. Buddy's chilling. chilling. See, See that's been good. our diet. I've been going to the gym every day. All I'm getting out of this is we can... All I'm getting is is we can remove stuff from this body and not need it. And not need it, yeah. You should not be going to... I'm not lifting. I'm just literally on the treadmill. Yeah, like just light weights, you know. Yeah. Well, I, well, I did do a little bit of shoulders. How many deadlifts did you do? Had to do the shoulders. You shouldn't <sighs> do lifting weights until you get those patches out. Are your stitches out yet? Nope. Nope. Okay, don't. You'll pop a fucking stitch. <laughs> I stopped. Weights. He's not like lifting 100 pounds. No, he's not. Lifting. I was only doing like 10 through the motions. After just surgery, you're not supposed to even lift it, like as much as like 40 pounds. Yeah, I it said, it said 20. 20 is like the max. Yeah. Or I can't lift. Anything. Makes sense. You don't want they told burst. you that before you left? Yeah, I can't lift. So I can lift like more than that. Three or four weeks. Yes, you can. <laughs> you can. But I was, I was picking up my, I was picking yeah, up my dog right. and shit. Oh yeah, Bella's like twenty two pounds. No way. Yeah. Seriously. Seriously. Your dog is twenty two pounds. Bella. Yeah, she's big old thick of. She's big a old thick. She got no neck, bro. <laughs> she ain't got no neck. <laughs> Remember those memes for a long time? Long neck and no neck? You yeah. remember those yeah. two guys? Yeah. Yeah. God, that was like... A lot. No neck's dead. Like, no neck's dead? Yeah, I just made that up. I think he's like... <laughs> what? You can't just start saying shit like that. <laughs> I, I, something happened to him, though, didn't he? Yeah. Something Did he die? Oh, shit. Happened, but like, what about I think that? I think Let's search arrested. up that no neck guy. He what happened to him? Arrested. What happened to him? I think he got arrested, actually. Well, not him. Not that not guy, him. but yes. But that guy is, <laughs> but that guy is no neck he's, guy. He's him. He's that guy. Did he get married yet? It's an alpha male. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Because wasn't it like when he got arrested, it, that's what made him popular was his mugshot. Shot. Yeah. He looks like the bad guy off the mask. You ever watch that movie with Jim Carrey? <laughs> 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 he looks exactly like that guy. Nothing? Did you see that guy who was on Joe Rogan about prison reform? Prison reform? Yeah. And that. It's been like all over the news recently, where he was on the, on there for prison reform, saying like you know I was wrongly uh, in prison for this many years and then oh, uh, yeah. got arrested for having a headless torso in his apartment. Wow. Yeah. In his apartment building. And he was in wrong? his apartment. He was wrongly arrested. He was saying I was wrongly accused of my uh, <laughs> original crime, and then he's on there being a prison reform activist, saying like justice needs to be oh, overhauled. Sure, uh, and then, like, the next week, they found a headless corpse in his apartment. <laughs> <laughs> Head was in the freezer. Corpse was in a bucket. Yeah. Oh, well. That's what you meant. I thought you meant, like, he got out on that charge. No, the original oh, yeah. one, I'm pretty sure he, he, like, killed his wife. Oh, my God. Yeah. He was, I'm trying to find his Instagram. I want to load, but... Uh, nothing happened to this guy? He's all right? <laughs> I don't really guess so. When you search his name, nothing happened. What happened to Wide Neck guy? That was <laughs> that's what they call him, Wide Neck. Arrested again in Florida. Yeah, I, see, I, I heard he got arrested. Yeah, la- two years ago. In the good state of Florida. Aggravated stalking. Mm. I've been watching those documentaries guy. too. The sto- I'm like, I am a killer made. A, I am a stalker. I think I've seen something like that. Yeah, bro. These guys are weird. These guys are fucking guys are really fucking weird, bro. Family, uh, stalking Child and support. Family can make support too. Yeah. <laughs> womp womp. The neckiest big thing. Sex be that guy. I had a, I had something like that where it was like stalking. I was like, bro, this shit's fucking. You have a stalking charge? No. Oh. Get a stalker. <laughs> Someone was stalking me. Really? Oh, oh yeah, yeah, my bad. Yeah, yeah I forgot. Yeah. Holy shit. I, I mean, they remember. It was like when we started the podcast. Oh, wow. was it was a while like, ago. It was a while ago. We done? Can't, it's, it's done. It's done. No, sense. no. Yeah, I've gotten way better. better. Way better. Yeah. I've gotten way better. He hasn't seen me once. He, <laughs> has, he, he has not been standing outside my house for eight hours, so it's been great. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, but no, I had a problem like that for a while. Swear to God, I'm not even kind of joking. I'm being dead serious. Holy wow. Mm-hmm. 
These yeah, guys were I, all of them remember it. Seeing his truck at the gym. Really? Yeah, bro. I was a dude. This this guy. I, I'll tell you one thing. He used all I know is for this. It was like where like I had to draw a line where uh, I was at work. This guy came. I I leave at work for whatever time. I actually don't want to say the time on here, but I go to work. He'd show up my house at like eight thirty nine o'clock and wait there all day for me. Wait there all day for me. Until I got home. Did he like you? Chase answered the door or something? There was one time where my sister got home late at night. A uh, gentleman got out of his car, walked up there, and said, is your brother home? I need to talk to him. And then, wow. like, it was, like, late at night. Like, super late. Like, my sister woke me up at, yeah, like, midnight. Yeah. So, it was, like, it was just, for a while, it was happening to me. Yeah. But I, like, definitely don't wish that upon anybody. Did he like you? Like, like you, like you, you're assuming? Or? <clears throat> I, I gotta be. I'm trying to, like... Be careful in the what what I say. Okay, it's like we can just keep this for off air if you want. We'll keep it for off air. You know what? You're right. That's okay. a better. Yeah. I'll t- I'll tell you after about yeah. it. But it's yeah. fu- it's fucked. Okay. But yeah, no, like uh, watching that doc- uh, those documentaries and shit. Yeah. Like, bro, it's especially it's scary, the first the first one I watched, bro, was like this guy was stalking this girl for so long, and then he he broke into that like they hid in a shed because this guy was following this two couple for so long, hid in the shed. Ends up, dude ends up breaking into the shed, killing the guy. Wow. Yeah, bro. It's like that, like... You ever seen the Tinder swindler? You ever heard of that guy? I heard of that guy, yeah. That guy. I haven't watched that documentary, but I heard it. Oh, my goodness gracious, that guy. He used to go around, like, random women on Tinder and then just, like, ask them to wire him money. Thousands and tens of thousands of dollars. It didn't work. And he would just get it? And he would just get it. Like, but I'm saying, like, I think he did it to, like, seven to eight women. He did something like that. I'm not for sure, so don't, like take my word on that but yeah. like a lot of women a lot of money came out of it and they made a whole Netflix documentary about him I, I seen it was on Netflix good I never watched it <laughs> good for him he found a niche and he, he went with it he did with it yeah, yeah. but yeah. that was it he was just taking money from these women yeah like yeah, he didn't money. do anything else no. right yeah he didn't, like I don't think he met up with them like maybe a couple times but like just taking money flying around the world and just lying about everything yeah. I remember this one documentary where it was like my the worst oh, I forget what it was called. I thought it was called like something like the worst girlfriend ever. Or yep, something I heard like about that. that. The guy, and the girl was, following that guy or whatever. Yeah. He was like a big star or something like that. Yep. Right. Along those lines. Yep. And she, he ends up getting a m- bunch of money. And the, every time they were supposed to meet up, like something happened, they can't meet up. And it ends up being a dude or something. Yeah. Right. I think I heard something like that. Yeah. Ends up being a dude that was taking money from this other guy for so long. People and he was just, weird, man. And he was just presenting to be a girl. People, yeah. Do you remember that? Do you know I, what I'm talking I, I about? Think, I've heard something like that before. I'm pretty sure, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Inspired the whole show Catfish. Yes. That's, sh- that's a lie that also. I made that up. But yeah, Cat- yes. Catfish is a crazy show. Catfish crazy is show. a crazy show. Though. That one guy where it's like... I love that show, though. So, yeah. you're, so you're gay, right? And he's, he's like, like oh, I ain't gay. I ain't gay. You're having a romantic relationship with my man. You got me there. Well, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, you uh, got me there. Okay, you got me there. And <laughs> oh, Do you know what he's talking about? Pull that clip Pull up. Pull that clip up. <laughs> Catfish, you got me there. You got me there. You literally, that's all you got to say. Search up. I bet you it comes up right away. Because that shit was wild. Yeah. I remember seeing that clip for the first time. Yeah, this is it. Literally, this is oh, it. Oh, this guy. Yeah. Yeah. He, I've seen him everywhere on social media. Like, <laughs> that, yeah, this that is was, just something I was doing. Was, it went a little further than I that wanted. That wasn't acting. That was real. That was real. It's a real show. Yeah. Yeah. That's a real show. Yeah. Reality TV, There's yeah. No that seemed like acting. That was horrible, horrible That's, acting. Yeah. No, I that think that was a real show for a bit. The problem is... Acting? The problem is some of the other ones uh, are definitely real. Because, like, people start crying. Crying and, like, get heated. I think oh, that yeah. was real. Also, I think they were both mic'd up. Yeah, no, he was mic'd up. I uh, guess, but they said okay. that he talked to him the night before, and he was, like, all down to confess and shit like that. Yeah. That's why he was so shocked when the guy came up, and he was like... What are you doing? Like, why are you, why are you acting, acting like, like this? this? Like, yeah. I thought you were going to come up and confess, like, yeah, it was me. I did it. And then after, he's like, no, I'm going to talk to him. Like, <laughs> I'm going to talk to him. I'm going to talk to fucking him. I'm the one wearing the pants. I was like, okay. <laughs> I don't remember that part. <laughs> but that dude, yeah. That that was that was a fucking show that was going on for a minute, yeah, too. Bro. It was like five or six seasons. Ago. Yeah. But like, I, yeah. It was like, giving me, like, 2008 vibes. Yeah. Something like that. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah, dude. That show, that was a show. And then, do you remember fucking Chris Hansen? Remember yeah. That, that show? Yeah. That show predator. was fucking insane. I remember I, I had to watch, go back and look at old ones. I'm like, why did they stop the show? And then we searched it up the one time. Yeah. And it was like, God damn it. Yeah, that's why they had to stop. But 
<sighs> God. That show was great. You know, Once you, you catch the a governor doing it, it's bad. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Fuck. Do you, re- do you know, remember Chris Hansen? Sounds very familiar. Chris Hansen, he would catch... Uh, to catch a predator. To catch, catch a predator. Why don't you have a seat over there? <laughs> <laughs> so, like, they would have, like, people who are acting as children okay. who convince these guys to come over. And then, like, you know, they'll come in the house. He's Canadian, too, right? Yes, he is Canadian. Hey, he's from Toronto. And then he'll come in. Uh, they'll be like, oh, what's going on or whatever. Like, so, you know, whatever they're bringing, either alcohol, pizza or something. And then all of a sudden, the like, you know, the actor leaves. And then Chris Hansen walks out. And every time, they're like, right away. Remember that one guy? Chris? Chris Hansen? Chris Hansen. He knew who it was right away. And the guy was trying to run. <laughs> yeah. Trying to run. But every time, they have cops surrounding the... Yeah, to catch him. Yeah. The catch him. The one time predator. Chris knew the guy. Yeah. Like, Chris knew the guy, the, like, took the pedophile the subway, showed up. Took the subway with him. Yeah. He took the subway with him every morning, knew the guy. And he was wow. like, and he was like, holy fuck it to you. Even he was surprised. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. You, I you just, just never know. Yeah. No. You can't do those shows now. No. No. There's nothing like that. There's YouTube. Like, YouTube, there's YouTube people do it. YouTube channels do it. There's that one guy yeah. that got, his name's Alex something that does it. He, where he catches it. Remember he caught that uh, ED, EDP? Oh, yeah. He caught yeah. him. Do you remember EDP? Uh, that no. guy who wore uh, he always Eagles wore the jersey. Eagles shit. Uh, oh, you got to You almost got to search it. You got to search I it. Have to see. I remember you, faces, yeah. I'm telling you right now. As soon as you see him, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. But they, right, that yeah. Alex guy caught him. So uh, I, know, I know Vitaly does it on YouTube. Yes, he does do that it. Guys, he wanted Sean Strickland five. to do it with him. Huh? Yeah, he did. Sugar four, four, five. Yeah. My boy's getting a knockout tonight. For, uh, go Pretty to sure. images. Well, I wa- yeah, I, I fucking nailed that. Look, this guy. You remember him? Oh yeah, yeah. I know. I know. That's him. I wonder right here, yeah, that one right there. Yeah, I mean it's all right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they they he that guy caught him. Caught him. Wow. And Don't then this guy's a predator. Oh yes. yeah. Oh, and fuck. then and then look on, at him. And then on top yeah, of that, <laughs> so they arrested him, charged him with that. Not even a couple months later, they caught him again. Yeah. Oh. Yes. Really. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Is he in jail now? Nah. I know. That's he's so streaming on very obscure websites, though. That's so weird. Because he's banned on everything else. Uh, yeah, probably. understandable, yeah. <laughs> I was watching this guy. He was reading out the text, and it was like, he sent that uh, who he thought was an underage chick, like, three different pictures of, of his shit. Yeah. And it was like, this guy's just weird all the way around. Like, some people are just fucked up. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, fucked oh, yeah. up. Yep. I remember I had a buddy... Uh, and he told me his neighbor was like, this is the story he told me. He said his neighbor four separate times got caught with uh, child pornography on his fucking cam, uh, his uh, laptop. Mm. Oh, wow. Each time the next day, this guy was delivered to his home by the cops. Wow. They, d- they brought him home themselves each time. I don't understand people like that. I, uh, I don't. People with marijuana offenses. I don't understand how you're going well, home. Well, not in the state. Well, in the state too. Yeah. How are you going home? How are you going home? That's what I mean. How like you want to talk about like if you want to get to like drug possessions, uh, that shit, mm. all that. Like mm. you're telling me what if as a taxpayer, what I want someone to be prosecuted for. Like, listen, I'm not saying like selling drugs isn't bad, but you're talking about a crime like that. You should straight be serving, to the mind. You should, yeah, yeah. You should be serving yeah. some fucking time. Yeah, I like, agree. Yep. There's no way you should be able to get away with that. Not to mention, no, even no. my story, like four times, and the next day you get delivered home. What the yeah. fuck does that happen? It's the criminal justice system, bro. It's twisted. I don't know That's why. twisted. Like why? It's twisted. Like each time, and like you know, we don't even change don't that. There's no change in that rule. No. Like at no, all. Never. No. Like the fact that someone could each every time get out the next day like that. Like yeah. that. Yeah. I mean. It's great. It is. It's fucking wild. It blows mm-hmm. my mind because yep. if you're asking me as a taxpayer who I think should serve more time, this ain't the drug dealer. <laughs> it, like I'm not. I'm, no, they, dead, I'm not saying selling drugs. No. I'm not selling. I'm not saying selling drugs is not bad. Mm-hmm. It is bad. Like yeah. you should not do that. Yeah. But if you're asking me, what offense is worse? Some guy trying to sell uh, sell drugs to make money, or this fucking guy ruining. Children. Children's lives, yeah, like lives. Yeah. You're, you're, you're telling me which one weighs more. I'm gonna say more, that one, yeah. scarring mm-hmm. people's lives yeah. and families. But yeah, like, like bro, even I watched the documentary. You should watch it called Athlete A. It's called Athlete A. Was a documentary of that. Do you know who Larry Nazar is? Nope. Larry Nazar that sounds familiar. Larry Nazar was the uh, he was a doctor, a physician of 
uh, the gymnastic, the Olympic gy- gymnastic oh, that teams. Guy. Yeah, that guy, with, like, bro. Simone Biles and all of them. Yes, like, when they were, bro. Yeah. You want to talk about a fucking up. guy? That dude. That fucked dude is up. fucked in the head. Like, especially for so long, that committee fucking letting him get away with a bunch away of shit. Yeah. Like that. Fa- the fact that whatever that, that the guy's guy. name was. Yeah. The, like the president of the Olympic uh, yeah. or uh, the women's Olympics team. You never heard about he, that, Zach? It sounds familiar, like Nazar. This guy, so they, there was, there was on report at the end of it. There was a report that says that he sexually assaulted over uh, five hundred women. At the end of it, yeah. all by the way, kids. not women, not kids, women. The kids, children, kids. kids, like thirteen, like Simone girls. Biles, all these young women, like young prospect, like athletes, gymnastic just, athletes, like, molesting. How does this keep happening? Because he was a doctor. Yeah, but like the it way it happens, twisted. the way they all the time, yeah. bro. The way they caught him was because eventually some obviously girls came forward. All came forward, yeah. Because they were like, because he got reported, and then they finally there were so many reports that they finally had to like investigate this guy, which is fucked. And he because he would say like, well, I got to put my fingers, you know, yeah. and whatever. And then each committee after decided like, there's no reason for you to even ever be doing a doing procedure that. like that yeah. at all. Especially to young, uh, young, young kids, kids and women like that, and then after you fucking like right away, like they got you got caught and it was like multiple, like it was it was a crazy bang, documentary. Bang, bang. Like yeah, it was huge. this guy, like huge. so many red flags that came up that came up that people just ignored because they were like whatever, like you know we gotta just keep the team going. This is the best physician. He was a physician for fucking Michigan State, bro. Was she, like crazy. for Michigan, yeah, bro. Crazy. It was a whole documentary. It's fucking wild. And now, and then the, I, uh, one of the trials, I remember the dad asked if he could get, get five minutes with them. And like that, when you hear a parent say that, it's like you get that pain. Like I'm not a parent by any means. But you understand. But you understand that pain. Like where it's yeah. like, bro, it it almost is like. It doesn't matter what the justice system does because they will never be enough. No. no. Like, even if you keep that guy in there, because especially you got to think with all those girls, a lot of them, that's their first ever experience of like intimacy. Like, not that's not intimacy, Something but like you get what I'm like saying? That, yeah. And then, like, you, you, and then you get away with, like, you know, even you getting life, that's still not enough. No. Like, it, it really no. isn't. Like, I get it, some people have like, their qualms of like the death penalty and stuff like that. Yeah. But like that motherfucker does not deserve. Well, that's the rules to- of jail. Is that like when a molest, <coughs> like a child molester or a rapist or a person that's like raped or hurt women and children. Yeah. You're dead in jail. You're dead. As soon as they find out you're dead. You're dead. Like the, even the, the guards look the other way. Yeah. You're, you're going to die because and it's, I stand by that. Because it's, tr- I, it's truthfully I not enough. So much. It's truthfully not enough. Like how the, mm-hmm. like you're going to sit there and tell me that a person gets to sit there and live, like still get to live. Live. Yeah. But like th- that's where I go. Like I know it's it's just it's a hard uh, it's a hard topic. It's a hard topic because people just don't want to. They also like there's a lot of people that don't agree with the death penalty at all. Yeah, and like no, yeah, I don't. No, with the no. death penalty. Nah, if, like I think if you're a child molester like that, like get your fucking arms cut off and your dick cut off, turn that shit into a vagina. What or if someone like murdered someone though? No. Like what, I've if, what said- if someone murdered your mom? Would you want them dead? Mm, no, I respect that. I think. I think the worst thing you possibly yeah. do is put them in a box, in a fucking box the rest of your life. Death is too peaceful. Yeah. Death is too easy. I think we talked about yeah. this before. Like put them in a fucking yeah, that fucking white insane suit and shit and just, just got a wall the rest of your life. Yeah. My, I would 100% that's that's I think yeah. is a punishment. Yeah. yeah. That is a punishment death too. But they do the death penalty I've because just, it's so much money. Like they have to keep that person alive. Yeah. You know what I mean? So like they put that death penalty there. It's just like, okay, this amount of time, we'll have them alive and then they're going to fucking die. So it's just kind of cleaning out the fuck. Especially like Death Row, too. Like Death Row, like yeah. a lot of those guys live like 30, it's like 25, 30 years before they even die. Die. Mm-hmm. Exactly. Yeah. It's also easy for me to say, like, oh, no, right now. It's easy to say no right yeah. now. Listen, like, my thing is if you're talking about the death penalty, look, I, get, I can understand some people's views on it. I can get that. Mm-hmm. But for me personally, like, I can't deal with that shit. Especially nope. me listening to that fucking documentary and shit. Nope. I can't. Like that shit fucking bugs me in a whole different fucking way. Yeah. Where it's like I do believe you should die if you took somebody's life on purpose. Yep. Like you willingly a- action like you took their life. I think you should die. Yep. I don't like. I agree with you. I get what you're saying because de- I get what you two are saying. Death's too peaceful. Mm. I get that shit. But I don't think you should be able to live on death row for 30, 20, 30 fucking years. No. Nope. Like you don't get that. I believe. Okay, you get sentenced to death row. You get five, whatever, six, seven years to get your shit in order. But you die, mm. like you die for that crime that you did. Yeah. Like you know, I don't, I don't think you get to live your life out the. Re- I get it in the yeah. box. I get what you guys are saying, but it's just for me, for me in that sense. I can't, I can't deal with that shit. I think, for me, anyways, I don't know about Zach. It's like, 
in theory, yeah, it'd be fucking dope if we could put every single child molester and rapist and like murderer in a straight jacket and let them sit up and stare yeah. at the wall for yeah. the rest of their lives. In theory, yeah. But to what Tyler said, it's like we can't fucking do that and nobody can afford to do that. Yeah. So yeah. you have yeah. to kinda turn to the death penalty to kinda get rid kinda of them. Get rid of them yeah. Yeah, yeah, but it doesn't I help got, when you're got, fucking got, taking care of them for twenty that. years. That's I got, what I'm I trying to get at. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 your tax tax dollars, dollars, your going taxpayer there. dollars feed that guy. Like exactly. what you're saying is like you get what you give. You get what you get. Like I believe, if you do that act, you're fucked. You're fucked right away. There's no, there's no automatic like thing that redeems you. Oh, I seen Christ. Like a, you, you hear that one all the time. Does not matter. Mm. You change, you change an individual's life for a long time. You don't desert. You, do, I, I, I can't sit there and justify it. Yeah, no, I agree with you. Like I can't sit I there and tell that, yeah. and say that you deserve to serve the rest of your life in here. And you know, that's it. That's all you get. Yep. Like and you know as, I mean. As a taxpayer, I mean, we don't have the death penalty in Canada, but I'm saying as a taxpayer, if that does not piss you off. I mean, how the fuck, if I told you that story where a guy in Canada told you that he had a neighbor who had child pornography on his fucking laptop four separate times and they drove him home. They delivered him to his home on, you know, you pay that cop. That's they delivered him home so four times. How, how that doesn't enrage I anybody, I don't know. I couldn't yeah. be a cop. Right, I'd lose my shit. I would lose my fucking mind. 100%. I would lose my fucking mind. Yeah, and to let, to let that guy keep you start going. Thinking like that could be my daughter, could be my sister, could be my right? mom, like, and, and my like especially brother when you, or anything. When you hear that fucking, when you hear that dad in the courtroom being like, "Just give me fucking five, five minutes. minutes. Give me yep. fucking five minutes with him." Yeah, because you know in that five minutes, the guy's fucked. He's done in the first minute. Guy's <laughs> fucked. <laughs> because even me watching these kind of documentaries and shit, they're like, like it just, I don't know. It gets yeah, me even sometimes. fucking like, boiled. We watch yeah. shit like this, or like I listen to like podcasts and shit about that. Even like I listen to a podcast about like Mormonism, bro. Like just going all the way back to like shit like that, where that is so embedded in there. Anyways, another story. But like, just turn it off. I have to like, w- like the Gabriel Fernandez documentary. Yeah, that was a crazy off. documentary like, too. Shit with like kids is so I just can't. You have to just turn it off, take a break, go fucking like watch Family Guy or something for three days, and then we'll come back to mm-hmm. it. Because like kids are just so malleable. Like they, they yeah, yeah, boy. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. That was, <laughs> that, that, that was a terrible time to say yeah. that. <laughs> <laughs> that was awful. Clip time. that. <laughs> clip <laughs> that. <laughs> I heard the uh, clip. No, Man, I, it only I, took I, us an hour and a half. I, we got blackmail on your ass. I, I genuinely. <laughs> Woo! I Got it on you now, Tyler. Yeah, Can't yeah, fuck yeah, it. Yeah, fuck. Yeah. Now you got to come back for another one. <laughs> I'm here, yeah. I got a little bathroom break though, so I'll be back. Oh. Yeah, God. You, that's you good. Have to show him where yeah, are. where is that? That's good, sir. Okay, Cheers. Let's just take a pause and he can go to yeah. the store. Shalom. Pause. Shalom. We'll take a pause. Oh man, like when we went there with me, you and Dave, and then you were like Columbia one. Yeah, the Columbia one, and she, you were like, uh, remember yeah, I was she, here? And she's she, like, you were high, whatever. Yeah, yeah. she called me. Yeah, remember she called she me up there. being high with my red eyes. Yeah. Well, she called because yeah. we okay. We were fucked. Like we took we took <laughs> a good amount of milligrams. Before, like so, we got into Gatsby's. By the way, Gatsby's great wings. It's they a do, great they, spot, they, man. Great, great spot. spot. Great yeah. spot. Food, you food, wouldn't though. think. You food. wouldn't think from looking at it and the people in there, but they're all phenomenal. Yeah. Shout out Kim. Shout out Kim. <laughs> um, pretty waitresses. Pretty wait. Yeah. And then, <laughs> yeah. but I remember we were in there. And we sat down. We took. We ordered a drink. I remember we got. We got beers. Yeah, yeah. We got beers. We sat down, and then I was like, "Oh, we just ordered our wings." Because the option they give you is ten or forty. They don't. There's nothing. <laughs> wow. They're like you either get. Jump. They're like you either get ten fucking wings <laughs> or, or you get forty. Yeah. Like, cool. so I, so we got forty and just split them yep. twenty twenty each. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. that's pretty cool actually. Kind of lame. Yeah, <laughs> each should have got 80. forty. Should have both committed. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, you for sure want to yak that? Oh, <laughs> oh bro, because I was in, I was in rough shape. He was saying that he's like, yeah, he's yakking, he's yakking. Yeah, yeah, so, I was happy. Happy. so I never. The the big yeah. thing is like, every time they try to get me to yak, because I was the only one in the group that never, never yaked yaked. from weed or from drinking nothing. I've never yeah. yaked. Yeah. Like even him, he got me a. Uh, so when we would pregame, we would get a bottle or whatever, and we would have to finish that before we go pre, like before we go out, we would have to finish it. So he <laughs> got me this shot glass that held four shots in it for his birthday, yeah. for his birth, for my birthday. <sighs> and he goes, so every time we take a shot, you gotta, t- you gotta drink out of this. And I'm like, oh fuck. Good friend. We did it. <laughs> we drank, we went, I still had to put them all to bed. Yeah. I remember you saying that. Yeah. That night, I had to put them all to all still them, bed. Yeah. But that night at Gatsby's. <laughs> We get there. What a night. Yeah. Order drinks. 
I and I'm like, hey, I got edibles on me. You want them? And he goes, yeah, give me some. Fuck yeah. <laughs> so I give him. So I give him. I forget how much we took. Did we take a hundred. It was yeah. I, we took a hundred. Uh, yeah. We might start with fifty though. May have started with fifty, but we took a hundred. Took a hundred. Nice. And re- like it hit. Uh, and this was after a while. Like I didn't take edibles, so my tolerance was pretty low. Mm. And it hit me like a tr. Like hit me and him both. Cause I. I Cause right away he said it. Yeah. He goes. Bro, I just realized now I'm high as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> and then I was like, yeah, wow. bro, I'm pretty, like, I'm feeling it. Yep. Smash back our wings, smash back our beer, paid uh, paid the waitress. We're done. Mm. We're walking out. And we're walking home because Gatsby's not far from my house. So we decided to walk because we, we want to get fucked up. Mm. We are fucking walking. And all of a sudden, the cold air hits me because I was having a hard time sitting in there as it was. Yep. So the cold air hits me, and I'm like, okay, fine, I feel good. And we're walking, and right away, I'm like, <laughs> and I'm like, ooh, ooh. and then yeah. he's ta- he's still talking, like he's not even realizing. <laughs> <laughs> he's still, he's still just yapping. He's still yapping, and then when he, because I touched yeah, I like, him, oh. we, were, we were walking. I went like this. I told, I remember, I told him, I'm like, shut the fuck up. <laughs> and, I like, and I was like, shut up. And he goes, and I'm like, and then after he goes. Shut the I hear, <laughs> shut the fuck up shut up shut up shut up, shut up. Shut up. <laughs> and then after I'm like and I'm like hold on hold on and I remember I got myself together I'm like I'm fine he goes bro I couldn't believe you were about to yak <laughs> <laughs> this is about to be the greatest day of my life <laughs> I was gonna tell yeah. everyone about that <laughs> <laughs> we get home we get home I flop on the couch both laying there he goes and I'm like. We're laying there, and I'm like, "When are you leaving?" <laughs> and he goes, "My Uber's on the way." He goes, "My phone's at two percent. Let, oh. let me see if I can get this Uber." <laughs> and gets the fucking Uber. He goes, nice. "The Uber's here." I dab him up while I'm sitting on the couch. <laughs> I'm just sitting on the couch. I dab him up. Yeah. He leaves, and I say, as he left, I'm like, "Okay." I got to get to my room. <laughs> so I go, I Find get to my room. Way, yeah. So I, as I'm like, he leaves, I'm going down my stairs and I feel like I have to throw up again. Yeah. So I run to the fucking, uh, the garbage pail. Yep. And I lay there for a second, realize I don't got to throw up. So then I decide I'm going to crawl my way to my room. <laughs> right. Only way to do it. So I'm on Maybe. my, bi- I'm, I'm in my kitchen crawling. <laughs> Like I don't even know how you can imagine. I'm crawling to my room in the kitchen. I get there and I open and I have a couple steps and then I can see my bed. And I'm like, you just gotta stand up and run. <laughs> and, uh, and I gotta full sprint. This there's no way. And I I oh I flip open this door. I see it and I run to my bed <laughs> and I flop. I swear to God, I'm sleeping. So like where my pillows are, I'm sleeping on them diagonally. So I'm, like, <laughs> I'm like sleeping on my pillows like this. And I remember at one point I wake up at like 3.30 in the morning, just room. <laughs> and I take off all, I remember I take off all my clothes. I'm like, what are these on me for? Take <laughs> off. Take the get these sp- chains off me. <laughs> <laughs> get my clothes. Get back in the bed. Sleep. She gets off f- from work. So comes, wakes me. Oh, this is recent. Yeah, <laughs> a couple months ago. <laughs> <laughs> so, so she. <laughs> so she. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this was last weekend. <laughs> <laughs> this is not that long ago. So she comes, <laughs> and, I'm like, and I'm like, "Oh, what's going on?" And so she, cause she gets home at like six in the morning. So I'm, I'm like, "Oh, what's going on?" And she goes, "How was last night?" And I was like, "I'm fucking pretty rough right now. I'm not gonna lie." And she goes, "Do you still want to go for breakfast?" So I was like, "Oh, can we order out?" <laughs> so we call Back Road Cafe. Shout out. We call them. Uh, order can you the get f- takeout. You can get takeout from back road. Shut the fuck up. Yes. <laughs> so Never had we, it. Back road. Oh, I, I told you. I told you. Gotta you gotta about go, it. bro. I so. Where is it? Where is it? What are you doing tomorrow morning? What are you doing tomorrow morning, dead ass? Probably hung over. So I'm down. Are you down? I'm down. Let's. We're yeah, going. I won't be hung over. You're working. You'll be hung over. I'll be hung over. Okay, listen. We're going to back road tomorrow. I'm not even. I'm dead serious. We're going to back road. Where is it? It is. You know the Grand Mare. You know the new ice park. You know the new ice park. Yeah. Right behind that bitch. Oh, right behind. It's a little place. Yeah. Fucking good. It's gonna be busy tomorrow. It's gonna be busy. It's Sunday. It's Lord's Day. Six o'clock in the morning. 
Mimosas. Oh. Yeah. They don't do mimosas. Yeah. What? You have to bring your own. They get the orange juice. Yeah, though. they're not cool. <laughs> <laughs> they got the orange juice. They won't provide the champagne. Uh, but Maybe if you ask like real nice. <laughs> but yeah, no. Please, 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 please. I need it. So we get that. I will tip you ten dollars. Sorry, yeah, and but. no, no, we so and then we go and I remember I just like I'm like, can you go grab it? Like, <laughs> no, I no, 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 you forgot the order. Tell him the fucking order oh that you my ordered. Oh god! <laughs> so I still ordered. Feeling nice from the night before. Oh, I was feeling fucking good. I was <laughs> fucked up the day after too. Yeah. Oh. I, was, I was feeling yeah, good. Dude, and man, you know when man. you like do like one of those orders where like you know you're not eating all that food. Yeah. It was one of those. You ate it and all though, right? No. <laughs> not even close. No. I I'll die. I got a waffle and I got and I was like, this is bullshit. I don't want fucking a side of bacon. I want three sides of bacon. <laughs> so I did. I got three. I ordered. and then when they, and when she went to go pick it up, they were like uh, a thing and another three sides of bacon. Yeah, bro. Okay, I walk in. I'm like, hi. So like, okay, it's me. I'm walking in for. What did you get? Oh, um, waffle. Waffles. Waffle. Waffles. I got the eggs, Benny. And then three sides of bacon. And they're watching me walk in and pick it up. So I walk in. I'm like, yeah, it's like it's a pickup order for rain. And they're like, okay, nice. Everybody there is super fucking nice. She looks at the order. She goes, okay, so it's um, waffles, <laughs> eggs, Benedict, and three. S- <laughs> <laughs> she looks at me, looks me up and down and goes, three sides. That can't be right. <laughs> Calls to the back kitchen and goes, did that order have three sides of bacon? I go, yeah, it's three sides of bacon. She goes, three sides of bacon? <laughs> I'm like. Three sides of bacon. <laughs> like, My boy's got to eat. Goes, okay, I was hungry. Kind of put in the fourth right separately. now. It was fucking so humiliating. Oh How much goodness. bacon is that? Three pieces each Three pieces side. each, so nine, yeah. That's not that much. That's not that that's much really bacon. That but that's what, that's what I said. That's what I said. That's what I thought. And my drunk mind thought that. Yeah. And mom was like, that's not enough. Like, you know, <laughs> you only give me three fucking slices of bacon. I need fucking nine. And Everyone else gives you four. You give us three. You're cheaping out. Like, as far as I'm concerned. What is this? But like, yeah, no. So I, but I didn't finish the waffle because it's just too syrup and heavy. But yeah, that bacon, yeah. I did finish. Hung over, it's syrup. Oh, I sugar, bet you finished the bacon for sure. Oh, dude, I'm a bacon <laughs> slut. I fucking <laughs> love bacon, dude. Oh hey, my, I don't mind it. Yeah. Oh God, yeah. I'll fucking do things to bacon. You know what I mean? I love bacon. I love bacon, bro. I have not consumed anything solid today. Hey, I'm, I'm fucking starving you today. What'd you have? Bacon. Uh, <laughs> I got brownies and I had a couple Pringles. Nice. nice. That was my meal today. That's good. Fuck you. What'd you eat? What'd you eat? I haven't. Oh. Okay. <laughs> What'd you eat? Four uh, slices of pizza. That's it. Really? What'd you eat? I had steak and eggs. Fuck you. For breakfast. And then a slice of pizza at his house. That was it. What kind of pizza? Cheese wheels. Cheese wheels, baby. Mm-hmm. Not as good as Windsor pizza. But shout out to them. He never had Windsor pizza till I put him on it. Very good. To me, though, like cheese wheels is my favorite. Yeah, Yeah. it's good. I don't mind it. Yeah. Mm. Uh, I talk about this all the time. I had my own friend argue with me about garlic, garlic, garlic crust. Windsor pizza. pizza. Really? Yo, you guys ever had omelos in Tecumseh? No. No. Um, Omelos? Yeah. Is it like a red and green sign? Or am I tripping? That's Armando's. No, no I red. think I've seen that though. It's red, like yeah, right over by the OPP yeah. station in Tecumseh. If you keep, if you go down Tecumseh, where the old Pace, Naples was? Going. No, I don't think oh, so. This is farther down. It's like if you kind of over by St. Joe's, a little further, and then there's the OPP station right next to that skate park. Uh, skate park. Oh, yeah, yeah, on right Park. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yes, right yes, there, yes. like just be- over the train tracks. I, yeah, I do right know what you're talking about. I've seen the sign. I've never tried. I've had that. I've had a slice in there. It's delicious. A slice of pizza is like six bones. Yeah. It's like this big. Delicious. It's fucking huge. Uh, it's so good. And they ha- it comes with like a garlic sauce. Is it right by yeah. Carrots and Dates? No. No. Carrots no. and Dates is west. That's dude. west. This is more on, like, this is by Les your Bros. house almost, bro. It's on Les Bronx. No, Carrots and Dates is on Les Bronx. Carrots and Dates is on uh, no, Wyandotte. I guarantee you search it up right now. You will find Les Bronx Road has Carrots okay, and Dates. Okay, well then there's two maybe. I'm, yes. I, there might be two because I know there's one on Wyandotte. There's yeah. one on Wyandotte, yeah. The one I go to is on Les But that pizza place is literally down the street from your house. Like down the street from Bourbon, actually. Yeah, yeah. You know where that clothes. church is right there, and there's like like Max Milk. I I, I know. Yeah, I got right you. beside that. Yeah. <laughs> I, under- I understand. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's good it's really yeah. good. It is good. Yeah, but I put him on Windsor. Good. He never had Windsor. Never. And then had I remember it. we got back from playing pool. It's still like, not as good as drunk 2010 Windsor pizza though. 
2010, yeah. 2010s. Maybe I can agree with that, but my like Aaron we killed them. was trying to sit there and tell me that Armando's and Aaron's Windsor and Windsor are the shit. exact same. He tried to sit there and we. Fuck I swear, I swear, in my life, just to prove a point, I ordered both. We did order both. We, we ordered order. both, just to and everyone was like Windsor, Windsor, and he's like, can't really tell the difference. And I was like, you're fucked. He's yeah. just stubborn. Uh, shit, he's gotta so, be just stubborn. Uh. He's so stubborn because he's like. Well, Windsor, we gotta wait forever, and I was, and we didn't even wait that long. Wait, like Armando's did come first, but it was like ten minutes after Windsor came, and he yeah. was like, "Well, at least Armando's was here first. I mean, like it all depends on how busy they are. Yeah, I was like, "There's also multiple Armandos. It's a fuck. Saturday. Yeah, that too. Yeah, like, there you go, yeah. there's also a Saturday, Saturday, yeah. there's like four Armandos in Windsor. There's, there's one, one Windsor, Windsor pizza, pizza. You yeah. fuck. Like you know, what I mean, yeah. try to explain that. You think we're the only one that fuckers are ordering Windsor pizza on a Saturday at eight p.m.? Fuck off. Yeah, it's good pizza. <laughs> It is. Put us on the map. Especially in, that, in the hood. In the OG. In the hood. Yeah. Everyone loves that shit. Mm-hmm. Oh, my God. It is good. Proper man. people. Yeah, they yeah. know. Yeah. They know what's Those up. People know. They know. There, you ever have uh, ketchup with pizza? Yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah. You're disgusting. I grew up on that shit, and I will die on that hill. You're just pretty good. The amount of time I've had it. Try it. It's not that good. It's not that good. I've tried it. You're hyping it up a little too much. My uncle loves it. I can't it. You're not a ketchup guy, though. I yeah, only ketchup with fries because you got me on that. Like, what like, do you mean he got you on that? Like, bro? I used to just dunk my fries, but now I'm scooping the fries. Okay, or scooping the ketchup because yeah. well. he's got me on. It. Like, it's good. I'm not gonna lie. It is good. Yeah, yeah. yeah I know when what you, you just mean. chewing ketchup. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, <laughs> pretty much what it is. You know how like hockey arena ketchup is like significantly better than all ketchup? Yes, yeah. yeah. because it's room okay. temperature. No, that's what I thought. Put a tiniest, that's mayo at tiniest Burger King. little bit of vinegar in your ketchup. Outrageous. That sounds pretty good, actually. So yeah, good. A little that's vinegar. I didn't hear you. What you mm. said? Put the tiniest little bit of vinegar into your ketchup. That's what arena ketchup is. Thank me later. Really? That does yeah. sound pretty good. I do like so vinegar. I'll try that. that shit. I'll try that. Yeah. Mm. Especially with fries, because yeah. arena fries are always the best. Mm. They, you I don't know why that is. Yeah. It's why? so true, though. You made them because they don't clean anything. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> See, Janny, good cooking it. is uh, nothing's clean. Yo, Chase, explain this to me. Yeah. Why is it? McDonald's doesn't serve hash browns after twelve. They don't. You know no, till till yeah. We I didn't find out. We totally know. did. Because no, remember, we the, totally well, did. Because isn't it the same vat? Yeah, it's just a hash brown. It's the same timer as the fries. Well, they clean the oil, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then they're like, now it's now it's fry oil. <sighs> I know, but like, yeah. isn't it the same timer and everything for hash brown? It's a little less time. A little less time. Yeah, I think it's like thirty seconds less. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean. But, so but they, I swear to God, seconds. they served hash browns <laughs> when we were going. After when we were working there, yeah, yeah, yeah they stopped that. They don't do all Just day twelve. They don't do all day breakfast. I mean, they, they do all day breakfast. All day. Yeah, so why browns. are they not serving hash browns? They, don't, they hash do browns it with fries. It. They did do that. That was an option. Yeah, oh, man, Is maybe it because they weird. expire faster. That's what it was at Tim's. Yeah, they expire really fucking fast. I hate Tim Horton's fucking hash browns. Yeah, they're not. I'll deal with it if I put it on my breakfast sandwich. Yeah, not deep fried with ketchup on it. Of course. Yeah. No, you that is good. Farmers wrap with That's ketchup like. kind of guy. Oh, pardon? You farmers wrap with ketchup kind of guy. That actually yeah. sounds yeah. bomb as yeah. shit. That's, uh, Never that was tried so that. So common, a lot of people did that. Yeah. Put some syrup on that bitch. Maybe for you. Oh, syrup would be good. <laughs> yeah. I like syrup, but like, just I on, love just syrup. on my pancakes and waffles. I used to take those shit like shop. My dad does uh, <laughs> maple syrup on, on pizza. Canadian boy. You said that? Yeah. I've heard pizza? that before. I, though, I feel like it's good. My dad and my brother. It sounds kind of good. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. Like sweet. Sweet and on savory, pizza? though? That's not uncommon. Depends what else is on the pizza. <laughs> My dad yeah. does uh, pepperoni, mushroom, and, and green pepper. That's mine. Yeah, no, I, yeah. that would hit. <laughs> yeah, that would, <laughs> that would be pretty good. I tried it. It wasn't horrible. I want a panzerotti now. My, uh, my, my, I've been swayed to panzerottis instead of chicken delights for today. They're good. Panzerottis. <laughs> They're so fucking so good. good. So They're fucking good. How did we swing back to food? Because I'm starving. <laughs> I'm fucking... Okay. I can feel my body degrading. <laughs> Before we get out of here, though, I, I did have something prepared, but it's really fucking boring. I'd rather do, do PYP. Can we do PYP? Yeah. Sure. All right, fellas. Pick your poison. Funnier version of would you rather. All right? Pick your poison. Uh, so every time you meet a new person, you have to openly rate them on a scale of hotness from 1 to 10. Or... Constantly have a ring of white saliva around your mouth. Oh well, I'm ring option hot, one. Hot to yeah. ten, yeah, <laughs> or one to ten, hot, yeah, yeah whatever. Yeah, easily. <laughs> Fuck you meet that your person, boss. You're like an eight, dude. <laughs> you're fucking. You're, you're, you're <laughs> <laughs> You got it going. All right. You getting the job? <laughs> <laughs> Buy 
and use secondhand anal beads. Oh my, oh my god. god. Or <laughs> walk in on your parents having a threesome with your anal best beads. friend. <laughs> anal beads. How used? <laughs> One anal time, beads. multiple times. <laughs> Ain't no beads. I'm going to option two. Really? What? Really? what? I don't want anything in my ass. You have shit in your ass at least once. I've like had some star, problems bro. the last few years. Fair enough. <laughs> Explain my gallbladder. Fair oh, enough. I can't. Uh, I don't want to see that, man. No. Wait. Yeah. Your parents with who? Your best your friend. Your best, best friend. friend. No. <laughs> uh, I'm good. I'm good on that. <laughs> right. I don't want anything in my ass. <laughs> That's crazy. Second hand. <laughs> I'm taking Second it. Hand I'm, like it. I'm not bro, saying that. Those no. bitches been used. <laughs> All right. Get your ass fingered by a man who just ate hot wings. Fuck. Okay. Without option two. Without washing his hand. Okay. <laughs> I don't care. Option three. Or bite off your own pinky finger. <laughs> pinky finger. Actually, the <laughs> finger is only as strong as a carrot, dude. You, you only bite you a carrot, you bite off your finger. To hold your phone. Like, <laughs> really? <laughs> what do you need to pinky my pinky for, dude? <laughs> Probably. That one was rather easy for you guys. Probably These too. ones are way easier yeah. than the other ones we did. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Get your tongue stuck in a garbage disposal mm. or eat a live rat out of the <gasps> New York City subway. I'll eat that rat all day. <laughs> Alive? Get your tongue wet, stuck where? Yeah, I was just fucking fucking you're getting garbage your disposal? Yeah, no more tongue because you can't talk. You can't talk. You, no, you're fucked. You're dead. That's going to rip yeah, out. Like yeah. Have, bleeding out, right? Yeah, you'll look, I have kill diseases. You. I don't know which one. There's a, modern medicine is a beautiful but thing. But have you ever seen a fucking New York rat? <laughs> yeah. They're fucking <laughs> big. Looking like a Canadian raccoon. Well, does it say eat it whole or just eat it? Eat it alive. Eat it well, eat it alive. I think I'd have to go to. You have I'd, to watch it squ- yeah, squirm as you bite into it. I'd like have imagine to go you're too. on a New York City uh, like subway and you just go. Mm, and those still di- picking too. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah I'm I still eating that rat. I still want to yeah. be able to eat the rat. Yeah, I, yeah. I have my yeah. tongue. I want my tongue. Yeah, yeah. I need yeah. that for other shit. Yeah, yeah. shout out. <laughs> <laughs> All right, this last one I think is funny as hell. But <laughs> okay, <laughs> go skinny dipping with your entire extended family, <sighs> or <laughs> have six foot long. Unshavable dreaded pubes. <laughs> pubes. I'm skinny dipping, dude. I'm I'm skinny dipping. I'm yeah, pubes fuck going. it. Dude, I gotta look. No, I'm just Dumb I'm jumping in the water look. myself. I, I ain't looking around. Closing my, my eyes. Closing my <laughs> eyes, baby. <laughs> I'm good. Closing your eyes, diving. <laughs> Closing your eyes, diving. <laughs> as long as it's the shallow end. <laughs> <laughs> shallow end for a shallow end. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. Yeah, no, nah, the pubes are just getting the weight of everything. Yeah, I mean, yeah, you're just I not can, seeing my dick ever. No. <laughs> 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 that shit would smell. It's a chainsaw. Just it's like... Uh, that's unshavable, dude. Nothing you can do. It's True, six yeah. feet. It's like the dictator. Think Aladdin. about it. It's six yeah. feet. Aladdin. 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 Down. You're dragging. You're dragging. Yeah, sticking on your pen. You're like, yeah, you're right. You're dragging. Yeah. yeah. And it's unshavable, so... Imagine somebody's like... Oh. <laughs> oh, are you happy to see me? Nah, those are just my really long dreaded pubes. <laughs> like, like oh my god! Oh, they're dreaded. Yeah, dude, the mm. six foot long like cool dreaded. patterns. But you could step on them. Imag- oh, imagine that. Oh. Yeah, imagine and they're unshavable. It's not coming off. Tug- imagine tugging from here. You step on it. Oh. Get it caught in your zipper. Oh! oh man. <laughs> imagine punting it away every time. You're walking yeah, on it, and some- or you're walking, and somebody else steps on it. Oh! Or oh. people, someone just came and grabbed them. Oh. Started pulling me by it. Yeah. That'd be my fear. Yeah. <laughs> That'd be my biggest fear. My sick of long boys. <laughs> Come here, boy. <laughs> no, Those pubes ain't that. going nowhere. <laughs> huh? Is that it? Um, oh, okay, that was the last PYP. I'll give you one situ- one situation. All right. Mm. All right. You're offered fifty thousand dollars, but if you take it, the person that you hate the most in the world gets a hundred thousand dollars. I get a hundred fifty thousand dollars. I hate myself. <laughs> I don't know. High IQ right there. <laughs> Job. I mean, yeah, because I'm still winning. Yeah, you know still getting fifty. I don't give a shit if that guy's doing. I'm going to hate them oh, regardless. Yeah. 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 Do you want to? I got another I'm reason to hate him. Richer, yeah. Another reason <laughs> to hate him. Yeah. Another reason for the purge when it starts. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck Get that money. Yeah. Back. Get that money back. <laughs> sure. Do the video. All Fuck right, it. Right. This, this will actually be the last segment. This is. All right. These are called. Yo, what the fuck? All right. Those are my. That's my segment. Are you gonna put like? Across the top? 
Yeah, what the fuck? Yeah. What the that's fuck? My, so, these are TikToks that I found. There's only three. So, I had to cover up the captions because she gives a spoiler. But, <laughs> I need you to guess what she's going to say next, okay? Okay. Uh, uh. Come with me to remove the tattoo I got. Oh, it's so Kay. cringy. Oh. <laughs> That's it. that's why I'm gonna stop it because the tattoo itself isn't that crazy. Guess what she's gonna say next. What was the sentence? Guess or bruh. Come uh, with me to re- get the tattoo removed that I got with, and then it stopped. Got with my yeah. mom. My, my abusive ex boyfriend. <laughs> my my dog. Okay, Jake. Obviously, you already know. Matching with my mom before I found out she was sleeping with my husband. Oh, <laughs> <that> was close. <laughs> Okay. The I got said, it, but I was a little wide. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's the, the tattoo. tattoo. That's why, because when Jake and I originally found this video, we were going to make you guess what the tattoo was, but it's, that's all it is. Yeah. So it's just stupid as fuck. But look at the poster that's in this fucking, this poster right here says, families are forever. Tattoos don't have, have to be. be. Oh, no. Mm. <laughs> that's a good quote. Next one. <laughs> what happens next? They fucking pelt that kid with a full gallon of milk. Okay. Mm. <laughs> what happens next? I already know. I, I they tell say. him he's adopted. I read the caption. I can't say anything. You read the fucking caption, you loser. I know. I did realize I forgot to cross that bit out. Anyway. (laughs) Oh, shit. (laughs) Yes, sir. (laughs) What's she doing with that? Graham, keep that thing on her. What's she doing with that? (laughs) Okay, Mimi. We should keep that title. Graham, keep that thing on her. (laughs) Title of this episode. Okay. What's she need that for? (laughs) She's getting flashbacks. <laughs> Nom. All right. This one. This will be the last one. What happened then? <laughs> that kid gets punched in the face. Braun comes in, saves the day. <laughs> LeBron James. They hit a crazy rebound. Um, <laughs> Kid's wearing 23. That's you, cool. What do you think, Zach? Let me see one more time. Parent, parent yells, you suck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, some type of parent yelling. Wait, 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 listen, listen, listen. <laughs> I'm her mom. It's fine. Dude, you fucking nailed the that. The mom said? Yeah, she said, I'm her mom. It's fine. <laughs> okay. hey, mom. That's me as a dad. You fucking nailed that. You dude. suck. You ever s- Okay, I I are you that. playing the rest? <laughs> 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 Gotta keep do humble. You, do yeah. you guys ever see like uh, like the memes are coming out lately where it's like, if I don't have like POV me not having a su- me not having a son, it's like me, me and my daughter at the uh, dance recital or whatever, and it's the cut where it, the meme is um, hey, uh, Jarrell, you got a cut, you got a cut. <laughs> 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 and it's like a football thing. It's, it's like a football, a football thing, thing. Yeah. and the dad's like freaking out. He goes, and then it's like me at the baller, uh, ballerina recital. It's like Jamal, you gotta cut. You gotta cut. You gotta cut. <laughs> <laughs> that would be me, bro. I'd be, I'd be in that stand, fucking losing my shit. What is that? You gotta cut. What's the practice? <laughs> yeah. yeah. You're not reading. You're not reading properly. Read the play. <laughs> If this guy does this, <laughs> you, know. you got to do this. Yeah. 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 That's hilarious. But uh, listen, I got. Yeah. we. Oh. Got, what's like one song you would recommend for like right now? Like top of your playlist. Faithful by Drake. Fair. That, that's a good one. <laughs> that's a good song. Another question. Mm. What would you switch the national anthem to if you could? Any song. Free bird, nine minutes standing. <laughs> nine minutes standing, standing free bird. That's mine. You gotta stand for nine I minutes. Know the song. I don't know the name right now. Macarena. No, that's a good one. The interstellar theme. 
That's awesome. What the whole soundtrack. The whole Interstellar soundtrack. Be like, like Star Wars soundtrack or something like oh, that. Oh, yeah. dude. Like the Imperial <laughs> like March. The Imperial March. Yeah, yeah. dude. Yeah. Freebird. Everyone's standing Bird. in their ass. Yeah. <laughs> Especially imagine that guitar solo on Freebird. <laughs> Oh yeah! Every morning and like in schools to making kids listen to the entire thing. Nine what? minutes, <laughs> nine minutes. Nickelback final answer. Sorry. Oh, what'd you say? Nickelback. Photograph Nickelback. Look at this photograph. Good song. I have my song. I just don't know the name. I'm sorry. Who's it by? You know. Sing it for me. I'll just. I'll just. Oh, he's it's gonna. It's on my playlist. It's on his playlist. He'll know it. Say that. <laughs> say, just sing it. Just sing it. Just sing it. Is that your final answer? The Star Wars theme? No, I'll think right now. What's your wh- wh- change of song to a national anthem? Love Sosa by Chief Keef. Oh, go. fuck. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, that's it. That's the right answer. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> These bitches love Sosa. <laughs> <laughs> With the whole speech at the start, too. Yeah. <laughs> Chief Keef ain't no hitter. Chief Keef ain't this. Chief Keef ain't that. My boy fucking Leonel. Nah, I like Spirit of the Sky. Shut the fuck up. Spirit of the Sky. Yeah. Who's that by? Uh, Norman Greenbaum. Nice. I knew it was so that's what you that's what you'd switch it to. Mm-hmm. And wow. it's a banger though. I do like it. It really yeah, is. Yeah. Yeah. That's that the is first it. song that came to mind. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And there's uh, any advice I can. It's already in my playlist though, so that doesn't help. Me. <laughs> so it's faithful by Drake. <laughs> <laughs> Good song, right? Yeah. And now to wrap it up, guys, thank you for being on. Mm-hmm. This yeah, is a lot it, of man. fun. Thanks for coming. We gotta go yeah. watch yeah. some yeah, fights. Gotta watch dudes fight each other. Yeah. Some blood. Yeah. You guys love just watching shirtless dudes do shit. It's so weird. I love naked guys grappling each other. Yeah. You guys like gather together frequently to do this. It's awesome. I got my fucking savings on it. Uh, <laughs> but uh, yeah, anyways, it's been fun. Thanks for coming on. Thanks First for time. Me. Appreciate me, man. Thanks yeah. for coming on. Yep. Appreciate it. I'm a vet. Right. Cheers. 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 I right. talk about vet. I'm on every episode. Also, <laughs> as we wrap up, I'm going to give a little advice. Get ready to hit end on this. <laughs> 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 on Blackjack, hit on 16. Good night, everyone. <laughs> Just received in our newspaper. Cheers. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, boys. All right, three, two, one, we're starting.